All right, guys, today we're going to get into God of War Valhalla, and we're going to do the full thing in one video. I might not be completing it all today, but this is going to be one video for you guys. Let's jump in. Let's do this thing. No messing about. Obviously, we've completed God of War Ragnarok. I have a full series of that on the channel if you want to check it out. And uh, we're going to start just on the normal difficulty, I guess. Uh, show me resolve. Uh, so this is, yeah, obviously it's a little, I don't know if you haven't heard much about God of War Valhalla. It's basically a rogue-like, um, a roguelite, uh, DLC. I, I think it's like six hours long or something like that, depending on how long it takes you to get through these combat sections. But it seems like there's more story involved than first anticipated. Let's jump in and let's do this thing. Playing God of War Ragnarok on the first time for my new monitor and on my new monitor. And goddamn, it looks glorious here with the waters. That looks re like real life. My man. You are certain you remember nothing of this place? Oh, nothing that would help us. Tell me, brother, why exactly are we doing this? I do not know. Oh, that's comforting. The graphics are absolutely outrageous, by the way. Like, I forgot just how good they are in Look, this game. I know you expect more from the smartest man alive, but Odin always kept me in the dark about this place. Which is why I urged you to seek Freya's guidance. Repeatedly. She does not seem eager to speak with me. Well, quite the opposite, brother. But you tell yourself whatever you need to. Alright, where am I meant to be going here? The little sparkles and stuff are so cool there. I see a shore ahead. Black sand. Exactly as described in the invitation. We finally bloody made it. So who's the invitation from, is the question I have. It's just us as well. No Atreus. No Freya. No cooperative play. So far. Something is happening. Back to basics then. Wait, did I lose my abilities? All right. Explore the black sand shore. Well, that felt unsettling. Like we plunged into a dream. Maybe we have. It is quite like unsettling coming back to God of War Ragnarok after so long and like the combat in God of War is pretty difficult, you know? It's pretty it's pretty hard. So to come back after not having played it for a long time, it might take me a little bit to get uh, used to it again. Doesn't seem anyone's here to welcome us. Why not? Locked. I don't suppose you'll take that as our cue to turn around and leave? I don't think he will, Mimir. <laughs> to be one's own master. Master thyself. A more poetic way of putting it, but yes. I play everything on the Hound without the green screen now. I was just playing some stuff before uh, I was doing some PGA Tour 2K23 and stuff just before I started playing this. That's why I had the green screen up, so apologies that it looks a bit stupid at the start there with the green screen up in the in the box, but all good. Come on, Kratos. You can tap it faster than that, brother. may not appreciate our breaking in. Okay, here's our first taste of the combat again. Let's see how bad we are. Not pretty bad. <laughs> I remember that, though. Chopped him in half. the sort of foes I expected to encounter here. Curious. Curious indeed. Evasive axe? Hmm. 
Drastically increases the power of the Whirling Storm and Evasive Storm skills. Uh, the Hoplite Lunge and Phallic Sprinker skills. Apply more stone and have a moderate luck chance. I'll go. Let's have a look. The skill video. Okay. I'll go with the Evasive Axe. Seems a little bit better. And I think I'm going to use the Axe more than the Spear. Okay, so we got a little tree here. Okay. Cool. At least you're not going in completely hobbled. True. Mm -hmm. You got some skills. Fuck y'all. Who else wants some then? You want some? Bruh. See ya. I love that attack where it like knocks them off as well. It's cool. All right, that's everyone. So we're gonna just clear little areas and then get a get a choice. Okay, a runic attack, a staggering area of effect. Which one is this? Oh, it's this one. Yes, I know that one. What about the fog of a thimble winter? I like that one. Maybe this one has a lower cooldown, so we should go with this one potentially. All right, let's go with that. All right. Nicely done. Anything else around in these areas, or is it just the area itself? I think it's just the area itself. You know, that's bright. <laughs> that is bright, son. Oops. Okay, that's locked for now. So down this way first we go. Perhaps the last remaining pocket of Asgard. Something unreal about it, though. Well, at least this part seems peaceful. We should have a look around. <laughs> A little bit of exploring in between, that's you nice. Believe Freya would have aided us in this. Aided us? Talk sense into you? Win win either way, really. I certainly can't see how there's any benefit to avoiding her. I am not avoiding her. Brother, you've gone to bloody Valhalla to avoid her. <laughs> At least be honest with yourself. It is not her I'm avoiding. I value Freya. Well, that I believe. I'm nice to hear you admit, frankly. I think she values you as well, in her way. She finds me useful. It is not the same. Is that really what you think? I do not believe she understands what she asks of me. I'm guessing we unlock these somewhere along the way, these other paths. Unless I can unlock them with my other weapons. Maybe. It's a possibility. Ow, bro. Come on. Oh, cool. Did I just die? Oh. oh. Already? Holy shit, I genuinely didn't even realize I was low or anything. I am stupid. Okay. My bad. I literally, like, didn't even know I was low. You marched into Valhalla without even talking to us first? Nice to see you too, milady. It was a personal matter. That would not take you from your duties. You breached. Valhalla, consider it worth my time. This entrance is secret. Who told you of this place? Nailed to our door three days ago. Kratos of Sparta, you are hereby invited to a challenge. Sparta? Face the past, face the future. Master Valhalla, master thyself. And then directions here. No signature. Who else knows of this entrance? Odin and us. It's likely a trap. You're thinking of going back in. Would you join me? Oh, don't let me intrude on your personal matter. Besides, I can't. Unlike the two of you, I've never died. What happens if I return inside? Well, that depends on you. Valhalla draws from the memories of those who enter. In there, you're an open book. Sure, you want to go back in. Hmm. How did you even get past the gate? I forced it open. With his bare hands. <sighs> he forced it open. <laughs> There's an easier way if you insist on going back in. Come. Sigrun... Maybe later we could continue with that one conversation, then? For once, Mimir. 
I think you've said enough. Ah, right then. Poor guy. And the other matter we discussed? You're still thinking, I take it? I am. Um... Is that what this is? Guess I'll let you think. The music. So good in this game, man. Alright. There you go. By the way, guys, if you want 20% off Rogue Energy, you can use my code DAPEX out and get 20% off your next order. Give it a shot. See what you think. Choose a shield and Spartan Rage. Huh. Okay. So we gotta pick one shield. I'll stick with the Guardian Shield, I think. Choose a Spartan Rage. All right, let's choose a Spartan Rage here. Fury, Valor, or Rage. What should I go for? Consume a chunk of Spartan Rage and gain a moderate burst of health. Time it right before being hit to negate the incoming attack. Gain an additional burst of healing and grant a melee attack bonus. This one is enter a stage of Rage. Each attack heals a small amount. Exit this state early by using the command again. I think I'll go with Fury, man. I don't know. I, I really want to... I, I like Valor as well, but I think I'll go with Fury. Let my sister speak to you of Valhalla's rules and its values. Okay. Yeah, I guess we were supposed to die, or we were gonna at some point anyway, so what whatever. This place. Valhalla seeks to foster wholeness and balance within those who enter. To fully master yourself, you can't rely on only your most familiar tactics. I use the tactics appropriate to the situation. Of course. But varying your approach will demonstrate to Valhalla the full mastery of your abilities and Valhalla will reward such demonstrations. Be sure to come back and see me as you progress. Okay. Sounds good. What have you to say? The challenge of Valhalla is not merely about overcoming obstacles. It's about the way you overcome them, how you demonstrate mastery of your own powers. We can guide you down a path, but Valhalla will be the judge of your progress. Return to me when you've met a goal, and we will observe the effect. Okay. Step up to the gate when you're ready. ready. Air, Gunnar, with me. This is badass. Do I have to sing like that if you guys aren't here next time? Now you can enter Valhalla by this gate. Without suffering the penalty of breaching. Thank you, Sigrun. Later, Freya. Okay. Now, I gotta be more prepared this time. Because I, last time I didn't realize I was close to death. I gotta be keeping an eye on my health a lot more. Any cursed feeling this time? No. All is well. Thank you, shield maidens. Alright, let's try this whole thing again. Ow, bro. Oh, you like them apples, boy? Thank you. Put them in half. See ya. Oh, I didn't reach him. Come on. All right. Shield mastery one of five. Whatever that means. Okay, Rage Mastery, one of three. What should we go for first here? New attempt, new choices to make. A Ooh. Stopped. We'll go with the Hyperion Blades, plus. Guys, gotta love the Blades of Chaos, right? Speaking of, let's use them. I love, uh, honestly, I know the Blades of Chaos are the OG and stuff, but I, I think personally my favorite weapon throughout the whole game was the, was the axe. I love the abilities with the axe, the ice abilities and stuff, I really do find them. Be quite. Ow, I wasn't ready. <laughs> These are fun to use as well, though, aren't they? <laughs> These are just fun to use as well. Odds between you and Sigrun. Did you anger her? I wouldn't say she's angry with me. Irritated, perhaps. 
Disappointed, certainly. Ah, but you needn't worry yourself, brother. I won't let it distract from whatever it is we're doing here. Okay, then. Cyclone of Chaos. This is with the blades. Okay. That looks fun. Or Hades Retribution. Yeah, I definitely think this one looks cooler. Um, to be fair, it does have less damage. It has, it's more of a stun attack, I guess. We'll go with that. The Cyclone of Chaos. Let's do it. Okay. We're good to go onwards and upwards now. Onwards and upwards. Yada, yada. I need to get used to using every weapon again as well. Like, the Blades of Chaos are different from the spear and the spears. So we'll try the spear here just because. So, this is no piece of Asgard at all. Just something spun from your memory of it. Fascinating. Fascinating Brother, indeed. I must admit, Freya's idea does make quite a bit of sense to me. What better god of war could the realms ask for than the general who won Ragnarok and won it trying to save lives? With you on board, our whole peacekeeping council could really do some good. This Fact. position, this title, I have held it before. I know what happened. She knows what happened. Of course we do. But why should who you used to be matter more than who you are now? Can't you see how far you've come? However far I've come, I have done it running from that life, that title. So that's what this is about. That's why they're talking about, uh, maybe Freya set this whole thing up. Doesn't seem like it, but maybe. Because, um, they talked about us facing our past and stuff like that in this. So potentially, that could be very, very interesting. How do I blow those up again? I forget. That's out. That's sick. Honestly, that was cool. Come on, bitch. That's all you got? Come on, I'll take a best shot. Yeah. Come here, boy. <laughs> yeah! You're done, son! Where are you at? You silly little bitch, yeah. Ah, oh, I wasn't ready, bro. <laughs> Don't mess with me, boys! Alright, a door appeared. Oh, we got some health there, though. Noise. All right, what do we got here? Seize strength while wielding the blades. Stun grabbing an enemy or three grants a gift of strength. I'll go with the seize strength, I think. A weapon glyph. Okay, and this is the way, right? I don't think there was any other areas back along here. Not down there. So this is the way. Forward we go, my friends. Forward we go. Let's do it. I suppose this is about how you remember your name, eh? I do well, agree yes. with you about Freya's counsel. It is a noble idea. It should succeed on her merits. How's that, brother? Freya is known to the realms. Good girl. Native to them, respected by all. An experienced leader. Experienced enough to know that a shared power is best for the people. That she would share power proves she is worthy to wield it. Even so, why make her wield it alone? Without Odin, the realms have a chance to forge a new peace. When conflicts do arise and can't be talked through, a god of war ensures those conflicts have rules and enforces them. They need might and judgment and credibility across the realms. Who else would she pick, brother? True life. We got good points down here. Oh, can we get down there? I think we can. Seems like it's locked, though. I'm guessing we somehow unlock these using stuff in the in Seems second runs, maybe. To bargain with Valhalla directly. Glyphs purchased at the at a tablet of Endeavor will be lost at the end of an attempt. Okay, you know what? Let's upgrade our runic. We'll be using the axe a lot anyway, so let's up, upgrade upgrade the stats of the runic. Okay, cool. It's our first upgrade, pretty much. What do these What do these things do? <laughs> I don't rightly know. We'll figure it out at some point. A lot of mysteries still to unfold in this uh, version of Valhalla. Oh shit, we got enemies right away. 
Oh, you bastard, you. No, I didn't mean to use that. Are you like them apples, boy? Yeah! That's more like it. Yeah! Starting to love the combat again now. We're starting to flow into it. Right, who else wants it? Come on, son. Okay. All good. Let's see what we got for the next part of our run. Fleeting Echoes, 200. Ooh, that's a lot, actually. Seems like a lot, at least. And this must be hey! Sparkleheim. Grail knows I would not refuse to aid her when in need. I have done and will do my part to fight for peace, regardless of title, regardless of whether I sit in authority. You know as well as I do there's power in words. Oaths. The people need to know you're committed to them and to yourself. That you'll be there for them, and I know that you will. I understand you've got misgivings, man, but you've put your past behind you. We all see it. You do not know everything that I am. That you were. You've told me of your past, and yes, much of it was horrible. But you've proven over and over again that you're not that man anymore. All good. All good so far. Hello, sir. Nice. Get that axe back, boy. Come on, what's up? You're done, son. You're done. Shit, there's more of them. Nice! That was beautiful, man. Yeah, get off the edge there, pal. See ya! <laughs> you bloody loser. Alright, there's more of them. I hear him. I don't know where he was. Shit, I should have waited. I hear more guys. There he is. Gotcha, boy. Alright, is that everyone? I think that's everyone. Nice. Beautifully done. And there's some health down here as well. Perfect. What you got for me today? Mastery seal. Some currency. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. I don't know what that even does for us, but... Sounds cool to me. Touch the ascending sands. There. That is the path we seek. A way up and forward. Valhalla's inner reaches. I can feel it. Okay. If there's an upside to this Valhalla madness, at least it's good to see you in action again. You're already more your cheery self than I've seen in moons. Without Atreus <laughs> or a fight in front of you, I wonder after your well-being. Combat can be terrifying. Indeed it can. It's so cool the way we're like seeing parts of the, of the map that we've uh, been through before. Just kind of sections of it as we remember it. I think that's a really cool idea. Okay, let's touch. Bring us on up, baby. What is this? You recognize your old seat, don't you? <laughs> Kratos. I have not forgotten the debt I owe you. Oh. Do you really think you understand the facts? This still feels reckless. Here they are now. That's odd. They're back outside, but we didn't... you know. Sometimes you reach as far as you're ready to go. Valhalla's decision or yours? Hmm. Does this mean you're done in there? No. I will discover who invited me. I believe I am close. 
You're sure it's worth dying for? Oh, I think we're fairly accustomed to dying at this point. Don't be glib, Mimir. Valhalla restores you after honorable death in combat, but beyond that, it makes its own rules. And if you don't play by them... Kratos, the threat of death in there is real. That is... good to know. If by good, you mean wildly disconcerting. <laughs> I do wish you luck. Truly. Thank you, Freya. The invitation has been completed. Alright. Do I keep my stuff or did we restart now? Indeed, indeed. Tell me what it says, Mimir. Do these tasks, return here for rewards. Fair enough. Visit the labor market to accept new labors and redeem completed ones for rewards. The marker offers tasks that are repeatable and cycle at random. Okay. Alright, appearance pedestal. Discover and unlock various armor and weapon attachments to customize Kratos' appearance. This is cosmetic only and does not have any effect on gameplay. Okay, cool. Stick with it. Alright, thank you. Let's start another attempt, I suppose. See how far we can get. Do you feel more complete than when you started? I guess. Now these would make a real and lasting difference. Oh, they're permanent. Okay, let's upgrade our maximum health. First off, the rip. Upgrade successfully increased health and the rage. Let's do the rage and the health once, at least. Um, because both of those are hugely important. Stats, let's see about stats. Alright, let's do strength once. And let's do vitality. We're gonna do those those four. And I think that's gonna have a huge effect on, uh, on our run here. Should be good. Thank you, m'lady. Can I talk to you at all? No? See you later. All right, back in we go. I'm really enjoying this so far. Like the loop and everything is uh, is fun. Obviously, only 40 minutes in, but so far so good here. I'm enjoying this. Let's see if the enjoyment continues. <laughs> Nicely done, Kratos. I think I need to be using like the the blades of chaos against them because they're ice, right? Drastically increases the power of the freezing throw skills. Drastically increases the power of the gale for it. Yeah, we'll go with the freezing throw, I think. Freezing throw plus. Onwards we go, my friends. Onwards we go. Open that shit up, baby Kratos. <laughs> See ya, wouldn't wanna be ya. Fleeting Echoes 32. The Mists of Helheim or the Scotty's Edge. A tracking axe that tro uh, throw that ricochets between targets marked by pressing R1 repeatedly. Yeah, we could do that one because we just got a, a big upgrade to that, didn't we? We'll go with that because we just got an upgrade to throwing axes, so it makes sense to me. I forget how to actually do those abilities, though. I don't know. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Look at the dent the axe made in the door. That's so cool. All right, my foes. Still locked. So yeah, we, th those are definitely going to unlock eventually. Once we, Look, brother, the more the we uncover. Valhalla's becoming more open to you, perhaps. Exactly. There you go. See in the distance there. You can see how all the little realm spaces wow, that is connect to the higher plane. Holy shit, statues. that's beautiful. <laughs> Did not mean to use that. No. I recognize okay. Them. Fine. They are judges of the underworld from my homeland. Ah, well, you sound thrilled to see them again. Souls they deemed righteous were granted entrance to the Elysium. Oh, there Chaos. they are. Holy Those shit. Souls deemed wicked were cast into Tartarus. Ah, yes, where the souls of the damned were tortured. Why has your mind manifested them here, I wonder? Look how badass that is, dude. Holy shit. <laughs> It's a different door than last time. All right, let's go through. Probably should have checked out around below first, but all good. Shit. What you doing? What you doing? Good dodges. Good dodges, Kratos. Let's go, baby. Nice. Hit him with the shield like it's nothing. Finish him off. Bang. 
Beautiful, son. Is that all of them? I think it is. And the door is opened up. Got it. Didn't even need to do that, but there we go. Yeah, sorry. I completely forgot how to do that. 44 minutes into the video, I figured it out at least. Runic attacks do increase damage against status-afflicted enemies. 75% uh, risked to all status effect. Yeah, let's do that. That's just a simply handy one to have. Like the poison would have affected me there. 75% less and stuff like that. That just seems like a really no-brainer ah, one to have. Midgard, ah, Midgard. Ah, I'm starting to see there's no fixed order to the realms we'll visit here. Indeed, Brother, there's not. Whose voice was that we heard when Valhalla sent us back from the throne? You heard it also. Aye. He said he owes you a debt, was it? Someone who might lend us a hand, perhaps? Unlikely. He was a god of Greece, and we did not part on good terms. And by Except that you it. mean... Yes, I see. No shortage of bitter old ghosts in these parts. These parts being your memory, of course. Indeed. Give me those fleeting echoes, baby. No, we got Mastery Seal. What, what is the Mastery Seal again? I don't actually know. Anything down here we can even get? Probably not. Anything down here we can get? Aha! What does this do? Defeating Valhalla's Chosen will unlock the Ascending Sands. This is locked until we meet Valhalla's demands. Okay. Defeat Valhalla's Chosen. Easy claps. Who is Valhalla's Chosen is the question. Are you Valhalla's Chosen, sir? I don't know. Come here, boy. That was a waste of time. Nicely done. Oh, I'm supposed to be using the Blades of Chaos here, aren't you? Yes, of course. I am brain dead. I was using the Frost one because it was Frost. You're supposed to use the opposite. <laughs> I am stupid. What am I doing with that one? I don't even know. Come on, you stupid raiders. Thank you. Good call. Good call, Mimir. Come on, then. You want some? <laughs> Block is pretty OP. Okay. We gotta remember that. Nice. Nicely done, sir. There you go. Light him on fire. Good night, Irene. One left. Oh, it's you. Hello, bud. Ow, man. Not cool. Chill. Gotcha. All right. Shouldn't have, shouldn't have lost that much out there. I lost way too much out there, but we do have a health item to give us back a little bit at least. Maybe the next one that we go to, the next clip that we go to, we can get a little bit of a health boost there. I'm still learning the game, right? Still relearning the game after 45 minutes, 48 minutes, I should say. The Mists of Helheim, Helheim or Leviathan's Roar. A powerful axe that throw, uh, a powerful axe throw that returns with devastating impact. Kratos is fully protected while shielding. Okay, so do I need, need to go in and be selecting these? Is that the thing? Like... In my... Do I need to go in and select these here, then? I have very, pretty much everything in the axe right now. As it stands. And if we're facing enemies like that, we're gonna need more. Did you recognize it? Was it familiar? It was mine. The throne I took from Ares. It is a throne of monsters. Ah, the anxiety of power made manifest. A symbol you're no doubt meant to consider. It is a symbol I reject. That might not quite close the book on matters. <laughs> a symbol can't be slain, destroyed, or ignored. The best measure is often to reclaim it, redefine it. Remind us it's not the throne, but the god who sits in it. Yeah. You're a smart man, Mimir. All right, guys, I'm finally back. It won't have been any time for you at all, but my god, have I had some trouble 
getting God of War Valhalla to work on my console. Um, the, I just had audio issues, consistent audio issues, glitching. It was unplayable. And, and eventually, I found the problem. I think it was more to do with my capture software than the game itself. So... I think it was the fact that my capture software only goes up to 60 FPS, but also I was I had 120 FPS enabled and my monitor supports 120 FPS and I had HDR set to always on rather than on when supported. I changed both of those settings and now we are back. Now I have lost some progress, unfortunately, but that's okay. We're all good. Uh, we're going to go with Fury because that's the one that's uh, glowing. The ones that are glowing are the best and we'll go with the Onslaught Shield, I guess. All right, but yeah, I mean, I, I was going to say sorry for the delay, but <laughs> obviously it's not really a delay for you guys. I guess the video will probably be out later than it would have been. As you know, she's attending to many things presently. All right, Freya. A new governing body for the realms is no simple task. There are leaders to find and recruit, negotiations for sharing power. I'm sure she'd prefer to be here, but you'll have to make do with the three of us for now. I'm sure we are in excellent hands. All right, so Freya's off doing her own thing, and we are going to progress. Now, I've heard really good things about this DLC, and I've been clamoring to get back into it. It took me maybe three, four days to figure this out. The first day, I sat at my desk for like five hours trying to figure it out, and I could not, for the life of me, figure it out. And um, because it was the only game, this was the only game it was happening on. And I think the reason that is, is because God of War Ragnarok goes up to... Uh, I think it's because this one goes up to 120 FPS and maybe some of the other games I was playing don't. That could be the issue, um, but I'm not exactly sure. Come on, bitch. Yeah. All right. I need to get back into the swing of things again now because I was playing Final Fantasy 16 and the combat's a lot different than that. I'm playing a lot of Final Fantasy 16 recently, trying to get that uh, completed before the end of the year because I want to go through a list of every game I beat in 2023. Um, I, I think it'll be a really awesome video, actually, including like old classic games, whatever kind of game it was. All right, drastically increases the power of the Elemental Siphon or Pride of the Frost. We'll go Pride of the Frost because I use the axe a little bit more than the shield. And let's be on our merry little way. Now, apologies for losing a little bit of progress, um, but it's all good. We'll get back up to where we were in no time at all. Come on, boys. See ya. That was sick. That was sickening. Oh, cut in half as well. Don't cut that. Don't cut that. Oh my god, dude. It's brutal. I keep pressing R1 to dodge because that's what it is in Final Fantasy, but you need to remember that that is not the case. Come here, boy. Oh my god, the brutality of it all is just on full display here. Ow, bro. Come on. Not cool, man. All right, I could have I could have interrupt interrupted that by double tapping L1. Good to know. I need to remember that. Oh, there's more. Oh, no, there's not. The god who sits in it. Facts. Facts, baby. But yeah, this is where we actually logged off last time. So we're finally back to where we were, nine minutes later. But there was some cool stuff in there, so I'll leave uh, I'll leave parts of it in. Defeating Valhalla's chosen will unlock the ascending sand. So that's not unlocked yet. This is what we uh, we did last time, and then we logged off right here. At this little part here. Now we might actually have enough to uh to upgrade a little bit before going on our merry little way. Minor health burst we could do. We don't need that because our health is full. We could do the rage. Our rage is at pretty much zero. Uh, fleeting echoes. This is the blessing of luck. Or we can upgrade the breath of Tamur, um, which this does look pretty go goddamn awesome. Does this reduce the cooldown is the question. Yes, it does significantly. So I think that that might be worth doing. Um, we'll upgrade that to, to two. And it puts the damage up to, to full pretty much. So this, if we're in a pickle, if we're in a bit of a pickle, that can definitely help us. This brings the frost up quite significantly on it as well. It doesn't bring the cooldown down. So I think I'll go for the blessing of luck on this one. And then I think that we will be able to upgrade our rage here as well. Um, we have enough to do that. So we can actually do it twice if we wanted. But I think I'll save the 50 just in case we need it in the future. So let's go onwards and upwards here, my friends. Onwards and upwards. All right. Come on, then. Should I be using the spear against that? Nice. Nice dodge, baby. Thank you for the call. Thank you for the call, Mimir. Shit. 
I love that. I love that ability. Ow. Nice. Double whammy. That was sick. To be honest, I don't think the spear is actually the one I'm supposed to use on this. I don't think it matters. Nice. All right. That's all of them, is it? Nope. It's gonna get me close to dead. Jesus Christ, dude, that hurt. We lost a lot of our health here. Nice. That's gotta be it, dead. Not really even close. There we go. God damn, that was actually a tough one. That was a tough one. We lost a lot of health there. I'm wondering if there's somewhere we can get it back. Because that was... A yes, thank God. Okay. I was gonna say, we need some health back. Alright, that does the trick, though. And let's see what kind of ability we get here. I can't believe this is free DLC, guys. Like, uh, how impressive is that that this is free DLC? Blessing of the... This puts up defense and vitality. Yeah, I think that's a no-brainer, really. Strength is important, but health and vitality is a no-brainer there. You just need the health, especially for a, uh, a run when you're doing like this, where you don't, like, kind of always get your health back. The more health you have, the better. Two fights in a row now. Okay. Now demands an escalator. That was sick. Right, I couldn't fucking get the blades of Kleos. Oh, this is Valhalla's chosen. Ow, ow. Oh, he has like a little shield. Okay. Well, fuck it. Let's go for it now. Go for it now while he's hurt. Come on, baby. Yeah! His shield's coming back up. Don't let him get his shield back up. Don't let him get his shield back up. Come on! Let's go! Valhalla chose an enemy to face me. I sense there are more challengers like it to find. Hell yeah, that baby. Is how we earn our way forward. That was sick. That was absolutely sick. Alright. Let's see what we get. So, uh, while wielding the axe, stun grabbing an enemy or three provides a blessing of cooldown. Or we could do this one here. I don't know, is that good? I mean, this one increases everything else. I think I'll go for the Blessing of Justice. I don't know. That could be a mistake. I, I still am learning. This is like my first run through of this. So, I don't know. I'm kind of still... I don't know like the best uh, builds. Okay. Path is unlocked. Good. More of the path is getting unlocked every time we uh, go through here. And we have one of these as well. I don't really need the health burst. It would only give me 20 health. I don't think it's really worth it. Especially, there'll probably be a health thing somewhere around here. Okay. We're cooking. Valhalla's chosen has been slain. So that means we can do the ascending sands. Let me just make sure there's nothing up here. So that means we can go up a level, I'm guessing. Is that is that like a checkpoint where if we die, we come back to this same point now? Oh, shit. All right, Fiske, let's have it. Fuck, man, I should be blocking. The cooldown on that thing's so long, man. Nice parry. Nice parry, though. Come on, Fiske, you little bitch. Nice, hit him on the way back. All right, there is a piece of health over there. If I need it, that's good. Nice parry, baby. Nice parry again. All right, we're getting used to the parry now as, as well, which is good. You need to be careful, though, that you don't overdo it because then you won't be able to parry some of those attacks like this one. Wilson Fisk, I'm taking you downtown, son. Come on, baby. Oh, yeah, right under the chin. Some of the finish in this game, you forget how goddamn good they are. Lore, okay. What sort must a mortal be in life to be given such power and authority in Valhalla? To wield a scythe and defend territory with such vigor? I imagine this Fiske, a farmer who took up arms against some threat and proved the depth at slaughter. And for his valor, he is awarded an afterlife of more slaughter. I wonder whether he even has a choice. All right. But we got two perk things here, boys. This is going to be pretty damn good. Rage Restore immediately restores a fair amount of Kratos' rage, like, right now? Nah, I think I'll go for this, because, like, that's good, but I can buy that at a thing. Like, you can't really buy 
Uh, well, you can buy these stats, but it's not going to bring your luck up and your strength up that much, is it? I'll go with the Blessing of Fortune, I think. We'll go with that, son. And then we'll go with this. This is going to be a long-ass video, by the way, guys. Just thinking about it now. Like, I'm going to have to play a few sessions, but uh, I think it's going to be worth it. It's going to be awesome. I'm looking forward to... Uh, to seeing how this turns out and if people really enjoy these kind of long videos like this i'm doing a gta 4 series at the moment as well it'll probably be a few parts deep by the time i oh wait look cutscene congratulations old friend. you really are going places in valhalla where's mumir is that really all you have to say to me after all this time can't muster up so much as hello for one of your most auspicious victims hello helios where is Mumir. How should I know? Why don't we go look for him? Hmm. This is sick. <laughs> we got the throne here. We got Helios. This is insane. Because <clears throat> I played the, the God of War, the original God of War games quite, like, they're quite recently. I mean, I played God of War 3 maybe five, six years back. Um, but I played some of the other ones uh, a little bit more recently in the memory. And yeah. It's so cool to, to see us going back to that kind of uh, Greek mythology here. Kind of a love letter to the OG games, it feels so, like. What's new with you, Kratos? Murdered any good pantheons lately? Devastated any populations with the cataclysmic consequences of your actions? Turned on any once trusted allies? You simply must bring me up to speed on your latest saga of blood Hello. vengeance. I am that no longer. You don't mean to say you've gone soft. Never believe it. Once a Spartan, always a Spartan. No, there's no fooling me, Kratos. You know what they say. You can't hide in the shadows from a sun god. At least, that's what they should say. We're at 77. Yeah, I think I'll go for the help first because I don't want to risk dying. I don't want to risk dying this early, man. Um, and we can save up for some other stuff. I don't really need anything else too, too much, but yeah, we'll go with that. So you actually can't um, buy any more of those rage things, even if you get to a new one of these. That's crazy. God, this game is like just incredibly beautiful, man. Like, look at this. Hang on a goddamn second and look at this. Like, this is genuinely one of the most beautiful games you will ever see in your life. Like, come on, uh, dude, this is absolutely ridiculous. So I don't think that's the same as the stuff we use normally, is it? Maybe it is. And I'm tripping. I think that's fleeting echoes, though, that we use normally, right? And this is separate. Say, the decor is looking a little more familiar, isn't it? A mighty chain. Auspicious side. Break the chain, Kratos. You've always had such luck with chains. This is all going to work out just great for you. I don't like the way you're talking right now, Helios. Oh, there it is. Home sweet home. Can I get down there? <laughs> yes, we can. What a cool way to do it, too. Those fleeting echoes, and then we can be on our merry little way. Okay, send the sands, Kratos. Will Mimir be back? No, we have. Oh no, it's still Helios. I thought there was neither of them there for a second. Must really take you back. <laughs> Wasn't this the chamber of sacrifice, where you let an Athenian soldier burn to a crisp just <laughs> to get past the room? Oh, those madcap early days! How you must miss them. We did have help there. Shit. I should have bought something else. Alright, so yeah, we're we're facing the past as Kratos. It's something that he really needed to do. What are you doing, Kratos? You mean to sacrifice me? Again? What if that's actually Mimir, though? Go on, big boy. Ah, I missed it. That was pretty bad of me. Mm. 
New bestiary, undead legionnaire. All right, let's see it. Ow. Not cool, bro. I don't need to use my rage or anything just yet. Nice. Good parry. You gonna stay behind me? Oh yeah, we don't have a mirror to tell us that someone's coming up behind us now. I wonder if a Helios would do the same. I don't quite think so. I don't think he would be uh He would be down to tell us that there's someone about to kill us. Now we gotta go back and get Helios again. Seems you'll need to push me along to get anywhere. Oh good. You're making eye contact as you push me towards my demise. What a special little personal touch. That's how we do it. <laughs> Especially after such a long and agonized deliberation over what to do. Oh, how reluctant you'll tell people you were to sacrifice me to the flame. <laughs> nice. I swear I saw a health item drop there. Where'd that go? Oh no, it was this. Yeah, come on, boy. You ain't getting nowhere with that shit on me. Ow. Come on, bro. Damn it. There we go. Got him. Cut his head off. See you later. Good night. Come on now. It won't work. But you do remember I'm a sun god, right? You think I'm afraid of a little fire? Don't threaten me with a good time, Kratos. Maybe I'll be infused with power and achieve my final form. Maybe I'll explode and take you with me. Let's just see what happens. Let's just see. Okay. Let's see. All right, here we go. Oh, we're forced to rage up here. Oh, shit. Yo, what? What is going on right now? This is sick. This is a new thing. Bruh. You want some too, pal? Legacy is now available at the Spartan you know, Rage pedestal on the shore. Hell yeah. Feel like you wouldn't appreciate it. Okay, Helios. You need for another push. Let's go. Gotta push you in again? God damn it, I'm sick of pushing you, Helios. <laughs> I'm sick of goddamn pushing you. Okay, seriously, Kratos, get me out of this cage. It's not funny anymore. I can't believe you need to roast me on a whim on a presumption that it's what Valhalla wants from you. Have you ever considered that maybe your instincts are just random thoughts that pop into your head? No more likely to be true than the next? Hmm? Maybe consider that. Quickly! Make a sacrifice. Oh. Am I sacrificing Helios here? You're really just going to incinerate me and see what happens? I swear you haven't changed one Sabbath. Brother? I knew it. What am I doing in here? Over here. Over here. I knew it, man. What's that? No! Get me out of here! Brother! What is this? Help me! I'm trying! Brother! Please! Please! I don't think it was actually him. Okay. Do not panic. We will simply return to the gate. I don't think so! 
I think you've broken her Valhalla once. <laughs> oh, I think this is it, brother. Oh shit! Let's get you out of here. Let's go, Sigrun. I'm not supposed to be here. That is so cool, dude. <laughs> All right. Look at you. You shouldn't have done that. Oh, heal, dummy. You and Kratos would not. But you're safe now. Sigrun, I'm sorry. I've been so foolish. I... Later, love. <laughs> I need a moment. As I will be forever in yours. <clears throat> so dope. <laughs> Participate in the sacrifice. I'm not sure about that, boss. Hush. It's nothing air can't feel. <coughs> this could take some time. Goals updated, okay. Go on, Kratos. Thank you, Sigrun. I'm on it. I'm on it, my lady. Well, that was altogether bloody terrifying. One moment I'm in a forest, the next I'm in a cage full of fire. You changed into Helios. And back again. It was unpredictable. I'll say. I'm truly not sure if we'd gone too far. Or if we've come too far to stop. We are not stopping. I must face this. I know, brother. We did more things and more things to do. Check. Okay. Got mastery, spiel and, uh, mastery seal and spirit steel there. Aha. Steel. Another of those spots for bargaining with Valhalla. Tablet of Influence, okay. Is offering some help. I'd take it. Upgrades are permanent and affect Valhalla itself. Divine Tramp, we need Chaos Cross, uh, Crest, Leviathan Crest, and Drop Near Crest. Uh, the most valuable resource in Valhalla used for the most powerful upgrades at the Shore Tablets retained on death. Okay. Enter Valhalla with 100 Fleeting Echoes. That could be pretty cool, actually. Um, just every time to start with 100 fleeting echoes. I might as well try that. So this is where you use the seals. Okay, that makes a lot of sense, actually. Offerings, light runic upgrade. Very low chance of finding light runic attacks already upgraded to level 2. Very low chance of finding heavy runic attacks. And increases the number of glyphs sold by Tablets of Endeavor in the lower realms to 2. Right, I think I'll go with the light runic upgrade. Permanent increases Kratos' strength stat. Uh, that's like, yeah, I'll go with one strength. I'll go with vitality as well. Get our health up to 122. Cooldown permanently increases Kratos' cooldown stat. I'll go with that as well. That's just a handy one to have, no doubt. Cooldown's always handy. Uh, I'll go with two on cooldown, actually, because why the hell not? And I'll go with another one on runic. So I think the critical health, or the, the health looter one is, is very handy to have. That sounds like just pretty handy indeed. Uh, okay, we need the divine triumph for this one. Uh, Kratos regenerates 6% of his health. Um, should I go with this one here? Permanently increases, uh, increases Kratos' maximum Spartan Rage? Or should we go with health? I'll go with health one more time, actually. I think we can do both. No, we can't. We need, we need 50, right? Alright, that's good, though. I think that's a, that's a good upgrade. Return to Gunner. I must return to Gunner outside the gate of Valhalla to inform her that I've completed her task. Inform her, then. But I don't think she's really ready to talk to me yet, is she? No, she's not. So, um, yeah, I think we just need to do that the next time we're out of here. Okay, let's head back in. Valgrind, okay. The host. Okay, let's do it. Master the lower realm.
Realms of Valhalla. Enjoy this, pal. It knocked off the edge. <laughs> Straight off. <laughs> I love that shit, dude. That's so awesome. I love doing that in games where you just, like, knock someone off a cliff or something. All right. It drastically increases the power of the Gale Force skills. Uh, okay, that's, like, that one. Or increases the damage that the Blains burns. Yeah, I'll go with that. Scorching burn. That sounds a little bit handier. So we don't have any abilities right now, right? No, we don't. Oh, shit. These guys are all poisonous and shit now. Weird. Weird and creepy. I'm on it, Amir. Don't worry. Ow, fuck you, man. Not cool, dude. I love the finishers, dude. They're so good in this game. All right, that's all of them done. Ooh, we have two chests open this time. Open for the perk lift. The Strike of Affliction. Shield strikes, double tap L1 against status afflicted enemies. Consume the ailment, causing a damaging elemental explosion. Or increases the damage uh, of all Kratos' ranged attacks and abilities by 30%. Oh, yeah. That's that's really handy. 30% is a lot, too. Okay. Especially with some of the... Okay. Cyclone of Chaos. A circle, a circling sweep attack that clears out all nearby enemies. So that's this one here. Is that Does that count as a range, range attack? Probably. That's the light runic attack. That's 113 seconds. Or we could do this one. Is this more a one-person attack? Well, it actually... Hits everyone. I think I'll go for the Cyclone of Chaos. Just seems like a little bit more... Um, a little bit more of an AoE attack. And we need the AoE ones, I feel like. Although we haven't come up against, like, huge groups of enemies. Ooh. Vanaheim. Memory of Vanaheim now. Cool. Brother, I beg you not to remember the exploding plants. Oh, Christ, yeah. Well, you just put it in my mind now, for God's sake, Mimir. about a forest? You remember being elsewhere when Helios took your place? Aye. Yes, I didn't mention that while we were plummeting, but yes. I was <laughs> in a forest, much like that of my youth. Back on my old body, too. It was a bit dreamlike, to be honest. Mm. Interesting. to return there. I can't say I don't. I'm concerned, but I'm more than curious. I guess my memories are fair game in here as well. Don't suppose they'll just stick to the pleasant ones, will they? There's two oh, yeah. options here. There's two ways to go. That's a little weird, right? All right, let's try this part first. I don't know if this is like a little optional thing. Ah, it can help inform choices. Open the menu, then press L3 to view the symbols overview. Okay. Runic attack glyph. Okay. Yeah, we'll go this way. Runic attack glyph sounds pretty handy. So you, there's like a choice now in the way that we're going. That's pretty cool. Oh, shit. Hello, freaks. There's help there if we need it as well. We'll probably need some. Yep, there we go. Probably need some at the end of this fight, I was going to say, but. That's already confirmed. Only a little bit so far. Come on. You want some? How do I get up there? Can I get up here? I don't think I can. <laughs> really? Not close enough? Come on down. That just kills them immediately. That's crazy. Oh, you're still oh shit. Cyclones of chaos, baby. All right, that didn't really hit the guys behind, but that's okay. Dodge and weave, son. Dodge and weave. Dodge and we, baby. Dodge and we. Look at this. He's gonna kill him with his own mace. I love that. I love that. Kill him with their own weapon. It's a beautiful, beautiful sight. What a life. What a beautiful, beautiful life. Look at the amount of damage we're doing now. Glorious. Don't you run for me, girl. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, brother. We're good. Bite frost or no bite frost. We are gravy. Okay, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm liking this run. This is good so far. All right, Meteoric Slam or Tame the Beast. All right, these are both heavy runic attacks, so let's have a look at this one. This is like just slam down and just, oh my god, okay, like actual meteors come in. And then Tame the Beast is a series of blade whip scorches. Let's see. Tame the Beast. Yeah, this one has more damage, the same burn, and it also has stun. 
Like the other one, I, I would imagine is a little bit more AOE uh, centric, but the cooldown's also a lot more. So I'll go for the Tame the Beast one. I think that that's the better choice overall. Do I have to choose here, or can I get both of them? Is it worth what it'll cost you? Oh, I that cost me forty health. A weapon glyph. What about this one? Forty rage. I could do forty rage. That's glyph. Yeah, I'll, I'll do forty rage because I think we can get that back. The health you can't really get back unless you get lucky with it. Uh, blessing of defense or blessing of strength. I'll go with defense. Brings our overall health up. I'm kind of a, I, I, I'm a guy that like always goes for the extra bit of health. I feel like it's just always going to help. But it probably it costs me a little bit sometimes as well because I don't have as much damage then, you know. Should be going for a little bit extra damage as well. Run back in Svartalfheim with the, uh, with the dwarfs, baby. Let's go through here. Doors chosen, two of seven. All right. These freaks are here. I'm gonna try catching my surprise. See, I wanted to catch him by surprise, baby. You little maggot. Tame the beasts! Where are you running to? What are you running to, pussy? I love how that hit the guy coming around the back, too. That was nasty. Nice! You little bitch! <laughs> Come on, now. You're done, kid. Is that all of them? No, there's a couple more. Oh, yeah! This feels good. The Blades of Chaos. Switch in mid-combat there. I think there's one more enemy up here somewhere. Get knocked off, fatty. Oh, yes. Oh, it feels good, man. I'll get my health back. Even though it's pretty much full already. Alright, anything else get unlocked there? I don't think so. Give us a perk combat glyph. Raging Affliction increases the rate at which rage is gained when attacking status afflicted enemies and using runic attacks. Increases the stun dealt to air... Yeah, I'll definitely go for Raging Affliction. That sounds like the stun in, the, in enemies that are airborne. I mean, that doesn't really sound that handy to have. So I'll definitely go for this one. And we shall continue on our merry little way. Asgard Sanctuary. Talk about that image of you in the shrine we keep seeing. If Valhalla keeps pulling it out of your head, it must have some significance to you. Could it be that the idea of being loved and respected is a fair might better than the alternative? I hear me out, and it's not as though I'm the smartest man alive or anything. But don't you think joining Freya's council could put you in a position to walk that path? To earn that path? Well, that would be a poor reason to accept. Ambition is poison. Oh, well, okay. Let's go through here. Let's get it, baby. What a life. What a beautiful, beautiful life. What the hell is that? Oh, Jesus. Okay. What's up, boy? Ah! Wasn't fucking ready for that, son. Come on, big boy. I'm taking you down by the horns, son. He's going to grab him by the horns in the R3 attack. Watch. Oh, my God. He's dead before I could even do it. You're about to be too, my lady. Is that even gonna reach her? No. <laughs> hey, enjoy this, guys. <laughs> Didn't even lose an ounce of health here. There's still a health thing there. I'm not even gonna bloody need it. Hate that. I hate that when there's a health thing and you don't even end up needing it, man. It's like, come on. I could have used it. All right, we should get an attack glyph here, though. All right, Huldra Charge or Scotty's Edge. So Huldra's Charge would be this one here. That does look pretty cool. Or a tracking axe that throws the ricochets between targets. So that's this one. Yeah, I don't really like that one. I'm gonna go for the Huldra Charge. That seems pretty cool. What is this, a boss? Does that mean it's a boss? Well, Hollis Chosen is here, shit. 
nice. Which one is Valhalla's chosen? How? Oh, I actually dodged it last second. No, I didn't really. Don't worry. I got this, baby. Cut off both their arms. That's kind of messed up, honestly. Yes! Come on, man. Where's Valhalla's chosen? Man? Don't even bloody see him. There he is. Get over oh! here! I wasn't ready, son! Oh, you like them? Fucking apples. Silly little bitch. Nice, that was beautiful, man. Come on. Bite frost resistance for the next few seconds. We're dominating this son of a bitch right now. You're dead. Nice, come on, you're done. <laughs> Touch the ascending sands, indeed we will. But first, just make sure we're not missing anything down here. What is this? Nothing, okay. Good to know, good to know. All right, another one of Valhalla's chosen has been slain, and the ascending stand sands will come for us. Blessing of strength or Slayer's rage burst. Low luck chance to grant a rage burst on any blade kills. Uh, blessing of strength. I'll go with strength because that's overall damage, and that will come in handy throughout the rest of our playthrough, no doubt. No freaking doubt. All right, we're going to go touch those ascending sands now, I suppose. Where were the ascending Splendid. sands down there? All right. We're and fear to take the way up now. Sounds like a plan, brother. <laughs> Amir the Goat. I love Amir. What a legend. What a legendary game. I still can't believe this is a free DLC. Like, this is like... Like, I know I've said that before, but... Kind of incredible. Oh, I could have just came right across there. I, I am stupid. I am stupid. Oh, shit. There was also a tablet there. Could have, uh... Upgraded some stuff. Oh, Jesus. I wasn't ready for this. I almost went into that thing. I remember these things were pretty bloody hard to fight back in the uh, actual game as well. Anyway. Alright, it's time to use some rage, boys. Come on, Drecky! Time to come downtown with me, baby. Nicely done, sir. That was beautiful. It's like old chaos, baby. We're about to get the other one back, too. Oh, just got that off before him, man. That was beautiful. Nice. Stopped him in his tracks there. That was beautiful. Gotcha. Gotcha. The Drekki's been taken down. I know Mimir feels much guilt for the damage done by introducing Drekki into Svartalfheim. It made enough of a mark on me that I seem to carry the guilt into Valhalla. Without you, the fight is harder, but our way of finishing this beast together is what I miss the most. All right, we got relics here. Relics in Valhalla have extremely short cooldowns, but limited charges. Activate a relic with L1 and circle. Uh, recharge them in a tablet of endeavor. Unleash a wave of shock to electrify enemies. Push enemy back with force and grant an aura of protection. I think the aura of protection sounds like a good one to have. And the master seal currency is going to bring us onwards and upwards as well. Okay, let's go through. Where to next, my friends? Must keep the primordial realms up here on the top shelf. Mosfelheim Sanctuary. Okay. In back to that image of you on the shrine. I'll grant you ambition can be a poisonous motive, but your ambitions are only to help people, not for your own glory, right? Make the world a better, safer place. I think maybe that image of you is symbolic of your desire to walk a righteous path. Valhalla's little signpost. You are sure accepting Freya's offer is the right thing for me? Or for the realms? I think we are here to make sure about that. One way or the other. Sounds like it. All right. Maybe just for this try, but a little assist would be nice. All right, guys. Let's continue on now, all right? I don't know where the hell I was going. I can't remember at the end of the last video, but I assume we had just completed some sort of boss or just got through this area. All right. We're on our bike. We're making good progress. I think I'm probably like nearing halfway through. I don't know. I played maybe two and a half hours or so by now. Um, but maybe I'm not actually that far in yet. Um, I think you have to play like six, seven hours to complete it. And it depends obviously on how fast you're you're doing the whole thing. 
Enjoy the ice, son. You're dead, baby. Nice block. Couldn't block the next one, though, because my bloody, uh... Hey, you like dickhead. How many attacks are you going to do in a row? All right, he's dead. He's dead. We're all good. Look how cool this is. Like, the the effects of the smoke and everything around me. Like, God of War Ragnarok is an incredible game, and this DLC that they've released is just as good in terms of visuals. Obviously, not going to be just as good in terms of story and everything, but, but I'm really enjoying the, the, the way that they, they've done this game. Because they could have done just sure, yeah. Come on. Bro. Which one do which one takes that this? Not that one. This one, okay. That was nasty. See ya! Wouldn't wanna be ya. Well yeah, like they could have just done a little extra story DLC um adding on to the game but they've done something different and unique and uh, horizon did that earlier this year and I, I enjoyed it don't get me wrong like the dlc for horizon i really enjoyed but this is kind of almost something that i enjoy a little bit more where i don't have to remember everything about the story i just come in and have fun with it perhaps the higher planes of valhalla correspond to the deepest reaches of your memory and it's doing like a throwback to the greek mythology kratos as well in the original god of war games which is uh is really cool there was actually a little a little article that came out recently well it wasn't an article it was david jaffe uh the creator of the original god of wars was talking about how he believes kratos has become too soft in these new games and i really like david jaffe actually i think he's a really entertaining character um Hello, he's really again. fun to listen to if i must carry oh, it's make you. yourself yeah. useful say what you see in battle aye aye asshole Okay, so he's gonna he's gonna help us out maybe, but yeah, like uh, I get where David Jaffe's coming from, but I really don't agree with his opinion at all. And the reason I don't agree with it is because I think that Kratos before, like for him to actually be a good character before, I feel like this progress is necessary. You know, if his character was just always that angry sack of shit, piece of garbage human then it, there's no progress throughout the games. There's nothing, you know? Like, I think that the these God of War games are a lot more interesting. Kratos is a lot more interesting in them than he was in the original God of Wars, personally. Um, like, he was... He was an interesting character but he was a piece of he was a piece of shit really you know he was not a good guy and that was part of the charm of the games of course um but also like the fact that he has character growth and he's really come around um i think is is to the games not to the game's detriment at all um the the recent games i think that they have been much more intricate and interesting and overall better games than the original God of Wars. Now, I know some people will disagree with that, but that's just my opinion personally. Um, I understand if people don't agree with that, but that's just me. I don't know. I, I, I think that these reboots of God of... The reboot of God of War is a lot better than the uh, than the original, personally. We'll go for the Cyclone of Chaos. I still I need to get some goddamn uh, abilities for my axe, man. All right, and let's touch the Ascending Sands and go onwards and upwards with Helios at our side now again. Yeah, I just overall think Kratos is a much better character now than he was. Guess we better poke around Three of them. Neighborhood. See what sort of a Timed meter challenge enemy difficulty will increase as each level of the timer elapses. The timer will halt upon returning to the Wait, ascending sands. Are looking to reconnect. A moderate challenge here. Oh. More challenge, more loot. <laughs> 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 Alright then. Come on, suckers. Nice. Thank you, Helios. Actually helping me. That's interesting how they played that into it, because that's what I was wondering last time. I was like, are we not gonna... He's not obviously not gonna help us, but I like that they kind of played that into it. Oh, yeah, that's one down. You took out Valhalla's top. In case you didn't notice in your killing frenzy. Thank you. Runic Immolition increases the damage of Blade's Runic attacks when the Immolition scale, skill gauge is fully charged. Blessing of Vigor, Strength, and Defense go up. I'll go for the Blessing of Vigor, I think. The other one's pretty handy, too, but I think I'll go for this. Alright, so that's another, That's one down. So we gotta be quick about it, or else it's gonna get more difficult. Is that what... That's what you're telling me. 
Hello. There we go. Nice. Come on, sucker. Fucking. Incoming back here. Nice. Oh. Enjoy that, pal. Good night, Irene. Is that the chosen right there? Does the purple mean it's chosen or what? I can't watch out. Thank you for that, Helio. Thank you, Helio. Good call, man. That was sick. Beautiful. Labor redeemable. Or redeemable. Hug it out. Timer's nearly done, though. Timer's nearly done. We're going to have to be quick about this. Whiplash deflection, blazing blades, drastically increase the power of the blazing surge and blazing explosion skills. Do I even use that? While charging flame whiplash, mash triangle with the blades. Uh, okay, I'll go with the blazing blades plus, I guess. All right, we gotta be quick about this one. I'm gonna go right this time. Big, big mistake. Enemy difficulty increase, that's not good. That was late. <laughs> Sucker. All right, stats glyph. Let's go. Which one should we go for? Blessing of bravery or the blessing of strength? Definitely the blessing of bravery. Vitality and luck go up a lot there, so we'll go with that one. And let's go and try and find this uh, this thing, man. This is uh, it's getting a little tense now. There it is. Okay, there's one. Valhalla's chosen slain. This should be the this last one, one right? Easy. This one doesn't look easy, does it? Nice, that was beautiful. Oh, there's the Chosen. Come on, then. You bloody losers. That was sick. Ow, bro, come on. Come on. I'm gonna try to get rid of these bastards first and then. Nice, come on. Fuck him up, let's go. That's the chosen, done and dusted. Good night, Irene. No, he's not dead yet, actually. I thought that was the finisher, but now he is. Come on, I'm waiting for you. Sucker. Guess I won't wait for you after all. The way up should be clear. Honor thy fall in a long-range leaping dive that slams into enemies with overwhelming force. A heavy runic attack for the spear, is it? Yeah, we'll go with that, because we only have a light runic attack for the spear right now. And the luck is okay, but we already have our luck up quite a bit, so I'll definitely go for the, for the heavy attack with the spear. We really need stuff for our axe, but I guess we'll have to wait for that. All right, why is the timer still going down? We completed Valhalla's Chosen, man. Only getting harder as you delay, Kratos. Yeah, I'm ready to go back now. I just don't know where the hell to go. <laughs> there it is. There we are. We're back, baby. Let's go. This one's 250. Okay, I'll go for this one. Screw it. We'll, we'll sacrifice 250 for this, whatever it is. Increases immunity duration while evading and last second evades fire a, a volley of Bifrost shards. Uh, increases the healing from Hellstone's Rage and gear by 30%. I'll go with the healing. That sounds handy as hell, right? If it was just the, the healing things itself, I probably wouldn't get it. But everything? That sounds like a big, big upgrade there. I'll take that, no doubt. Heading back to the cage, are we? I guess Valhalla is giving you a second chance. Ooh. Rage is full. Heading back to the cage, indeed. Well, now it's a party. So this time, I guess we're not supposed to sacrifice Helios. Is that why we broke Valhalla? We sacrificed Helios when we weren't meant to? Or I guess so. Sucker! Boom! I love that attack. Beautiful. What are you planning to do this time, Kratos? Wait! No, don't tell me. The suspense is honestly the only thing keeping me awake back here. <laughs> He's such a little asshole. See ya. Good lord almighty. 
Oh, that was easy. Shit. Maybe it only counts as a sacrifice if I've you give up someone rage. you value. I think we all know that's not me. Notice how you're leaping to argue quietly. Oh my god. You'll never guess their weak spot. Yes, it's the eye. Some decent damage there. I'm trying to get one in the eye. Oh shit! Strike the tattered enemy with the appropriate weapon before rage is lost. Disrupted, you Done already. Confused? What do you mean? Why am I using that weapon? Bro, I was in the middle of using it already. Like I didn't know. See ya. Get him in the eye, Kratos. Pretty late. See you guys. Gotcha. Right in the eye. See you later. Good night, Irene. Beautiful. Cyclops have been taken care of. Let's see what brilliant move you've thought of. Make a sacrifice. Okay, what are we doing this time? Myself? We're gonna put myself in the cage? Yes. Um, Kratos? <laughs> Surely you're not supposed to. You know what? Worked, I think. Mimir, let's go. Oh, now we know. Higher, hopefully. Oh. Yours. I would have signed it, but it was important you come here for your own reason. Then you're not an illusion. You're in the flesh, old friend. What do you want? I know what you're wrestling with, Spartan. I understand it better than you realize. The shame, the doubt, the question I could find no answer for until I came here lifetimes ago, stepped through that door. What is in that? Oh, I'm not here to spoil that for you, only to help you prepare. Why? Because I can. Because for us, fighting occupies the body while our minds work out the rest. Because you're not ready. Yet. We're about to fight Tyr? Holy shit, okay. Show me. Oh! I'm sorry. Why exactly are you attacking him? Consider it a kind of trial by combat, Mimir. When Kratos can get the better of me, we'll know his mind is coming. I thought Tyr doesn't fight! That was Odin's Tyr, though. No wonder he wasn't fighting. Always impressive, Kratos. Thank you. I like to think so as well. Of course, I tried to block the one attack that wasn't blocked. But... Difficult. Having fun yet? Blast. 
Last indeed. A man at war with himself places a deficit upon his focus. He is impatient, emotional, easily surprised. Not me anymore. One with himself has a clearer mind, sharper instincts. That man is ready to win. That man is ready to progress. God, I love it. It feels so good to play, man. It's all of them. Come on, Tyr. Come after me, buddy. Is that all you got? And we're beating him up. We're beating Tyr up, baby. Cyclops, baby. Cyclone, rather. See ya, Tyr. Boom, uppercut. Brock Lesnar! Boom! No. Well done, Kratos. I yield. Good then. <laughs> Good then. That was fun. You got a size difference. Good lord. Perhaps you are ready now. Am I? Honestly, nobody can truly say that but you. Well... Tyr? Tyr has been revealed as having sent me the invitation to Valhalla. Despite my initial doubts, I do not question his intentions. He feels a kinship with me and only wishes to help me find my path. He is among the most formidable opponents I have ever faced, and I feel my skills grow. But his insight into my struggle is just as valuable. I now understand firsthand why he was so beloved in his time. Indeed. Thank you, Tyr. I should probably turn the difficulty up, seeing as I, I kind of beat Tyr fairly easily there, I'll have to say. But... We'll see. Maybe it gets tougher as we go. Woo -wee! Go on, go in. Blood, sweat, and tear, baby. I am not ready. Yet. But we will get you there. Okay. Oxblade Spear 2. Alright, so we weren't ready. Damn it! Come on, man. Sanctuary Barrier Key, Divine Triumph. New Eternal Labor Unlocked, The Cycle. This labor awards Divine Triumph and resets every time you defeat Tyr. The cycle can be found in the goals under Labors. Press the touchpad to access the menu. Damn right, baby. That's how we do it. Show me what it says, Tyr. Or Lemir. Okay. This isn't Sparta. Spartan kick enemies in combat. Okay. I don't even know how to do that. This is Sparta! I see you made it count in there. Indeed. Guna. For you, Valhalla appreciates every step of your evolution. I hear you like stories. I got one for you. Coming. I wasn't born with the privilege of some of my sisters in arms. I wasn't bred for greatness. I was just the daughter of some poor innkeeper. Matter of fact, I wasn't even his. He just raised me after somebody left me there. I didn't have much going for me, but I had one thing. I wasn't afraid of anyone. If somebody was asking for a punch in the face, I never thought twice brought a heap of trouble on myself that way it's true but i sure learned how to fight enough for now i'll pick that up later mm. Mm. okay sanctuary barriers keys to unlock sanctuary barriers can now be acquired from the tablet of influence oh okay that's what that is wants to help can be used to permanently remove a barrier inside of a sanctuary sanctuary barrier so i can buy eight of these i'll buy two because i got quite a lot Oh, a resurrection stone. Fuck yeah, I mean... If we die, we get a resurrection stone? That's just gotta be handy. Okay. Let's go onwards and upwards. Let's get back in the fight, baby. Relics can now be equipped. We'll do the stone wall shield as well, seeing as that's the one that... We'll just always do the, one, the ones that are glowing. And it, it makes us mix it up as well. So legacy is the new one. Oh, yeah. Seagrun. How fares your journey? Good. We have uncovered our host. It is Tyr. 
projects here, you say? Aye, and no projection either. I never knew his connection to Valhalla was so strong. But then, he goes back further than I do. Fascinating. Fascinating indeed. Okay. Let's go in. Thank you for your help last uh, last time out, Sigrun. Kratos, I'm glad to see you're back inside. It seems Valhalla has arranged something special for you in the throne room. See you again soon, Kratos. The throne room? See you, pal. Oh my god, his head came off with that. That was brutal. That was absolutely brutal. All right, activating... Yeah, I'll do the stagger resistance. Okay. None of them were that good, but... We'll take it, and we'll go onwards and upwards. Something in the throne room, you say. Let's go to the throne room, then. God, that's good. That's good, man. We're getting a lot more now for, for defeating enemies as well. Elemental Antagonizer increases the damage caused by extinguished flames and vaporized frost skills. Last second dodges and power Kratos' next attack to inflict additional damage. I'm going for that one. That's uh, pretty handy to have for sure. Open for a runic attack lift. Held. Oh, yes. We got one for the axe finally. An extremely quick burst of energy that interrupts and knockbacks all nearby enemies. Or a powerful axe throw that returns with devastating impact. I'll go for this one. Hell's Touch. Hell's Touch, baby. Onwards through the door we go. Axe Light Runics. Holy shit, that's bright. Ooh. I know this. You remember this, Kratos. The memory is vivid. A familiar scene to any that know your legend. A man at the crossroads of a fateful decision. Aye, you've spoken of this, brother. The pact you made with Ares. It gave off the barbarian horde. The day I sold my soul to a god of war. Mm -hmm. Why show me this? Well, if I had to guess, probably to make you feel like the piece of shit you are. Is he necessary? He's no part of my design. He's either Valhalla's or yours. <sighs> At least he hasn't replaced me again. Not yet, anyway. Seems a real charmer. Indeed. Indeed he is. That's so cool. Kind of getting some more backstory on this. Oh, this is new. A memory fragment of your time in Alfheim. Ooh. Burdens of Valhalla. Who was Kratos of Sparta the day you made your pledge to Ares? I was the youngest captain in the Spartan army. I had gained a reputation for my skills in combat, my command of the battlefield, but also my aggression. I was determined to never lose, and until then, never had. My men were loyal. Fiercely so. How many Spartans did you command? Not enough that day. How many barbarians did you face? Thousands. Okay, I'll go for the gold burden. Fuck it. You have to clear four encounters. My weapons are going to do reduced damage until the end of these four encounters. It's hilarious. Dope as shit. So we do have a key for this. That will get us some sort of perk glyph. We also have this. This is just a chest. Let's just go through. Let, let's save them for now. Until we know we need something. Okay, there we go. Oh, bloody hell, lady. Come on, then. There we go. Half triangle, close the distance, and then we're in there. Might as well save it for now, since there's only one guy left. Oh, there's more. That's ah, just a little cocksucker. See ya! Alright, that's... Oh, no, there's still another guy. What bloody hell is this dude? Bro, are you kidding me? Gotcha! You little son of a bitch, bang! I'm not sure I like this one that much. It's a, it's a little bit weird and slow, but... It's handy to try and close the distance like that. It definitely is, but... 
sure Valhalla's come to for you. Indeed. My sword isn't something full of terrible memories, I hope. What do you think? <laughs> a runic attack glyph. Which one should we go for? Oh, okay. We'll go down because the, the cooldown's a lot less. Cooldown of 200 plus seconds. Like, you're able to use that once an encounter, maybe. You know, so. It's a bit too long of a cooldown to be having. Why help prepare me to take your old position? Why not fulfill it yourself? You seem capable. To the mortals of these realms, I am an ancient long out of mind the days i could hope to unify these realms are long past but they see you as the hero of ragnar fuck it let's open this no respect from what i have seen you're the most qualified by far you need only be ready thanks buddy appreciate that all right so, appearance unlocked. Damn it. Black bear armor does sound pretty cool, but I don't know that I should have unlocked this for an appearance armor. I, I thought that was going to be actual, some kind of actual armor, but I guess we don't really have that in this. Uh, go to the question mark? Like, it could be whatever. Let's go through this one. Question mark? I mean, let's do it. The Riddler's out here. Chamber of Aeth. <laughs> Good lord. Okay, yeah. That's pretty good. That one's kind of more like a little stun attack, which I like. Ooh. Ow, bro. That was nice. A little stun with the shield, dude. Really? That didn't parry? Can you not parry those attacks, maybe? Nice. Gotcha! These ones are quite hard to fight, actually. Give him what for? Give him what well, for? This is an unusual little corner right, I see a of Valhalla, isn't it? Shall we see what else we can find in here? I see a C. Where is the rest of this puzzle? Are they through here? I think we're meant to choose one chest or the other. Shall we have a look? Sure. Bang, got it. All right, it was worth it was worth looking one last time for. There we go. What do we even get for it? Leviathan Crest, three of them, okay. Yeah, th those could come in handy for sure. I think that's worth, worth, worth. I hear enemies. Come on, then. Come on, you silly little bitches. This one's actually really good. Like, it's growing on me. Because it does just take down people's shields immediately and bury them, pretty much, you know? And you can close in on them really quickly. And that was, that was beautiful. Nicely done. Missed. You missed, motherfucker. Let's go. Didn't mean to do it again, but that's okay. Ooh, does that mean there's a little boss through there? I think it does. We got another runic attack lift. Okay, which one are we going to get? Ooh, we got one for the blades or for the shield. This one, they both have 94 second cooldowns, actually. Uh, and this one is the Cyclone of Chaos, which we've had in the past. Let's go for this one, because we haven't had this one before. Um, since we've started Valhalla, at least. Okay. Spear heavy runics. Oh, shit. Come on then, big boy. Oh, yeah! You're done, pal. You are so done, it's insane. I kind of got cut in half. All right, where you at, boy? Are you the chosen, really? Come on. That's it? You? Oh, my God. God, dude. No, that's not the Chosen. Okay, I was gonna say, that, that person was way too weak to be the Chosen. I believe your target's on the battlefield there. Yeah, it is. Okay. The Chosen's about to be the dead one. Good one, Turtle. Ha-ha! Cut him in half. 
And that is everyone. Dead and dead. Nope, that's not everyone. You. Oh, oh lovely. Out. Hit her on the way back. Come on, I'm not even gonna go up there. I just wanna kill you from down here. <laughs> Beautifully done. Touch the ascending sands. I love doing that. Okay. Hades Retribution, Light Runic Attack, or drastically increase the power of the Pride of the Frost Gills. I'll go with this one because we don't have a Light Runic Attack. I'd like to get Runic Attacks for all of our weapons, if possible. Valhalla's Chosen has been slain. And it's time for me to touch the Ascending Sands. Let's make our way up. Let us make our way up, sir. Return to ear. Oh. Really? Thought we're going up. Oh, shit. Come on, beast. Hey, enjoy this, Miklimonje. Nice, that was beautiful. All right, then, come on, boy. Did that put a bomb in? Yeah, it did. Cool. We are burning. Good point. See how quickly we killed him? Yeah, I feel like I definitely need to turn the difficulty up. It's a little too easy. I think I have it on, like, the, the normal one, but I think I need to put it on the... I, just a touch harder. Because I'm killing these bosses like they're nothing, you know? The cycle. Labor updated. And let's go onwards. Onwards, my friends! I'm back! What a thrill! Oh yay. <laughs> Great to have you, Helios. I must say, it's genuinely hard to think of anything stupider than pledging your soul to Ares of all people. I mean, any of Zeus's brood are bound to be garbage. Present company by no means excluded. But Ares made a real art out of being vicious and depraved. Though, I suppose I can't begrudge you your role model. I see you still use the blades he gave you. Can you really say you regret a decision? And still keep benefiting from the trappings of that decision? I'm not mm. sure, I'm just asking. You ever try to do the math on how many people died as a result of your little collaboration? Like contemplating the grains of sand on a beach is <laughs> overwhelming, honestly. <laughs> Let's take a trace and, and uh... What is that? We can touch it? Looks like someone left Trace and Fenrir, I meant to say. Oh, and it's a symbolic totem of your shame. That's so thoughtful. Oh, now you've done it. You're being judged. And we all know your past actions wouldn't pass muster with anybody. Scry me a river. Reclaim Otis's or Kratos's oath stone. Continue to Greece. Oh shit. Here we go. Oh, I meant to ask. How did you like setting yourself on fire? Truly entertaining stuff. Sorry to miss how it ended up. I think maybe you still have some ash on your skin. Am I crazy? I think maybe you're a scumbag, dude, but. Cost 250 fleeting echoes. Let's just go onwards. Upwards. Ascend, Kratos. What? Oh. I thought we already had. Gotta unlock the path forward again, I guess. Get 10 fleeting echoes off that. Okay. Hello. Siren? Cover my ears! Kratos! <laughs> oh, you bastard, Jake. Wrong weapon, man! Yeah, I got the right weapon now, don't worry.
Nice. Beautifully done. I love the way he tells you to use the wrong weapon like that. See ya. Yes. Immensely, actually. That was beautiful. Stunned him at just the right time and cut his head off. New bestiary, legionnaire captain. Shit. Come here. <laughs> nice. Gotcha, Siren. Stay dead, baby. The Siren has been dealt with. Drastically increases Kratos' melee damage when he is below 50% health. Okay. There's a rift. I'm going straight for it. I'm going straight for it. I know I'm being chased, but I'm going to just... You killed the thing with someone. Oh. Yay. Yay, indeed. Did you need any primitive armed ruffians? Looks like a proper Viking here, doesn't it? Ow, bro. Come on. Not cool. Just realized I'm pretty low on health here. Ow. I don't have a lot of things that bring my health back like I did before. Before, I had a lot of things that like brought my health back quite a lot. Melee attacks have a low luck chance to restore some cooldown for the equipped runic attacks. Last second dodges now charge the permafrost stimulation and maelstrom skill gauges. I'll go with the arcane refresh. Okay. We need to hurry up, though, and I need to get my health back if possible. Because right now, it's not looking good for me, boys. Ah, uh, maximum challenge, maximum reward. Oh, shit. This is the hardest one. That must be the one Valhalla considers a challenge. <laughs> On your left. I see that. Thank you. Don't let him call back. Yep, got it. Nice, that blew up just beside them. Really important. Yes, come on! Just about, man, but my health's low. I need to find a way to re replenish my health right now. Runic Storm, Blessing of Essence. Using runic attacks of three different weapons in quick succession grants a buff. No, I'm going for the Blessing of Essence. Fuck it. Man, I need health badly, though. Tell me I can get some bloody health soon, man, because this is getting to the point where this is going to be bad for us. I was just talking about how we are... Uh, we're fine, you know, and we haven't been close to dying, and I need to up the difficulty and stuff. And then, of course... Uh, is there any way I can, like, find a way to up my, my my health first? I think I just need to go for it before the difficulty gets higher. See ya, buddy. Get knocked off the edge, bitch. Oh, it's one of these fucks. Shit, die. I'm dead. No, the enemy difficulty just got increased too, I'm fucked. Look how close to death then. Holy shit, oh my god. We killed him. Give one back to the start and ascend or whatever it is. Give me some health, please. A massive fiery shockwave attack that sends enemies flying back. Okay, I'll take that. I need help, though, really badly. There, There's the Ascending Sands. This is the way back right here. Perfect. I need to just go immediately to that tablet, although I think new health was unlocked. Oh, thank God. That's going to give us a little bit of a buffer, there, at least. But right now, I think uh, I think the health thing is still sold out. Uh, getting a choice regarding health burst immediately restores a large amount. Nice. Yeah, I need to do it. We could honestly upgrade everything to max here. Right here and now, we could do it. I think I might do that. Because why the hell not, right? We're still going to have well over a thousand or whatever the hell it is. Okay. And onwards we go now. Upwards we go. Let's do this thing, baby. Oh, I'm back, brother. Kratos, you made it back. Good. 
We're gonna fight him again. Something else to keep things interesting. You're not the only one with weapons from far off lands, you know. Ready? Okay. Let's see it, baby. Thank God we have more health. Thank God we were able to just replenish our health. Otherwise, we'd be fighting here with pretty much near nothing. I pressed triangle. Oh, shit. I thought I was pressing triangle because it was down the bottom line. Come on, Tear. Blood or Blood Holy shit, okay. An attack of Olympian power. Oh, we didn't have much of that, but that's all right. Nice. I get that help. Get that help. Carry me. Look out. Tears using them to heal. Why did you do it, Kratos? Why did you pledge yourself to Ares? I was ambitious. Proud. I could not accept defeat. I crave power. No, no, no. Is that all? Are you sure? Nothing more to that story? Nothing else under the surface? Yes. Get out of here, you bastards. All right, Tyr got a lot of health back there. Ow. Damn, that took everything from me? Nice. Good reflexes. I'm impressed. Boom. Enjoy that bomb, son. Sheesh. Come on, we got him now. Let's kill him. Finish him off. Finish him off, Kratos. Nice. You done, T. Uppercut. Yield, boy. He does the F5 every time. Bang. Attitude adjustment this time. I yield, Kratos. Very well. Hell of a fight, though. Are we ready now, Tyr? Found an understanding within yourself. Shall we see? I hope I'm ready now. Wounds. It's not only memories. Indeed. For what is a memory apart from our perspective on it? You know the evils that came of your path. You know the evils within yourself. Yes, these you dwell on. But it's not that simple, is it? The horde is fast, brother. What would have happened if you didn't stop it? Our lands would have been overrun. Our people killed. Violated. People your army was sworn to protect. An army led by you. Did you not feel a duty to fulfill your purpose? Did you not fear for the safety of your homeland? You saved them. You would excuse my actions. Excusing them is not the exercise, Kratos. Only accepting them. Accepting that you acted based on what you knew then, not on what was to come. Your motivation and their consequences are far more complicated than you let yourself believe. Hmm. I think perhaps you have more to process. Yes. I have much to think about. I will return. And I will be waiting. Okay, so we're not quite ready yet. I thought this was the time, man. Damn it. All right, armor appearance unlocked. I want to get that bloody bear armor. Freya's back! Yes. His voice echoes in the halls. There's no mistaking it. So it's Tears' game you're playing? This is all his idea? A game is not his purpose. There is something here I must see through. And what is that exactly? A process. All right. If it's helping. I trust you both. We all do. As we trust in Valhalla. Even after what it did to you? I knew the rules and chose to break them. I regret nothing. Okay. The work part one acceptance completed. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Check out that new appearance. Oh, we can talk to you? Yeah. A gift. Valhalla recognizes your determination. Let it empower you as you evolve. Lunda's lost armor. I'd like to tell you a story that I think will help you along your path. Tell me. 
continue. Early in my life, before I was a Valkyrie, I was a healer in a small village. My father trained me in the use of herbs and natural remedies. To him, coming from a long line of herbal healers, that was the only true medicine. But visiting the city, I saw healers who used magic. Only magic to treat their patients. I'd seen it work and work wonders. I tried to tell my father, but he said mage healing was against his philosophy, a dangerous shortcut that violated tradition. Being a good daughter, I respected his convictions. But that all changed when he took ill. That's a good place to stop for now. When you're further along on your journey, I'll share the next part of my story. <clears throat> okay, sounds good to me. The belt of the black bear looks sick, man. I want that one. The wraps of the black bear. I'm kind of going with the full armor set for this, really. I think the chest of the black bear just looks too cool overall. We look like a proper Viking now, man. Oh my god, do we look badass or what? <laughs> we look sick as hell. All right, let's check this out. progress, but always more to be done. Great progress, but always more to be done. Right, mastery seal plus 40, spirit seal plus 60. The only true opponent in Valhalla is yourself. Nonsense! A moderate increase in the amount of fleeting echoes earned from defeating enemies. I'll go with this one, yeah, sure, why not? All right, I've pretty much upgraded all of my stats there. My health's up to 150 going in now. I feel like we're, we're more than ready, and we look badass as hell. So let us continue, brother. We have two relics now. The Onslaught Shield, okay. A shield fit for safely advancing on enemies. So we can rush forward on the enemies. That sounds pretty fun. So we'll stick with Legacy, I guess. Okay, there we go. We're ready. The Black Bear is ready. Come on, boys. The work part two. Vigilance. Thank you, Mimir. Appreciate that, son. Don't dust it. Once we keep going back in, I take it this process is working for you somehow. I guess so. Succeed or fail. I feel progress. Clarity. I need to see it through. Very good. Both elemental hunter. See ya, bud. Oh my god, that's brutal. Give him what for, son. Good night. Good night, Irene. Range specialist. Increases the rate at which rage is gained by 20%. Increases the damage of all of Kratos' range attack. I'm going for Raging Fury. That one's pretty pretty damn good, I must say. All right, what are we going to get? The Whisper of the World or the Huldra Charge? We have used the Huldra Charge in the past. This one has a bit more of a... Oh, that looks cool, though. We'll try this one, seeing as we haven't used it before. A little bit longer of a cooldown, but whatever. Oh, good. I'm, I don't want to stop playing, man. Like, I've been playing for an hour and 20 minutes. It doesn't feel like it at all. I feel like I just want to keep going. Oh, shit. An infamous act. One they still spoke of in the years of rebuilding. I somehow doubted they meant it so little. I'll give you this, brother. Your technique has improved immeasurably. <laughs> I needed his power to secure my vengeance against the gods. I believed I had no choice. No choice? You could have not ripped my head off my body. That was absolutely an option. And he's back. But that wasn't the worst of it, was it, Kratos? Killing me deprived Greece of the sun. They were plunged into perpetual cold and darkness. Crops ceased to grow. Famine descended on our homeland. Not that you cared. Enough. He is better, isn't he? I mean, it does sound like something to potentially be better about, you know? <laughs> Ruined this whole homeland, but yeah. It's far too fine. I'm curious. Your decision to behead Helios, was it fueled by any personal motivations? Or was it really just a means to an end? It was not personal. I did know him long before I killed him. He was as insufferable as any god. But his death brought me no satisfaction. 
Did you know what would happen as a result? When Helios was captured by the God of Dreams, the lands fell into darkness and were not restored until his return. I knew exactly what would happen. It's messed up then. All right, let's go through here for a runic attack. I love how we're facing Kratos' past here, though. It's so, oh my god, right, that guy. Watch your left. Yes, sir. Watch my left. Enjoy that, pal. Nice. Good lord. See ya. I love the way you can hit these with a shield like that and bang, they're dead. Come on then, you want some of the axe? Hey. Hey! Not cool, bro. Nice. See ya! See you in hell, boy! How the hell is he still at full health? He's like regaining his health. Oh, that little thing on him was um, healing him. Scumbag. I was like, how the hell is he still full health? Well, you're both dead now. That's what you get for coming after the great one, all right? Let's go over here and heal. We have to remember the heals don't give us as much healing anymore for four more encounters, which is actually going to be fiercely annoying. But the reward, I think, was worth it. Long cooldown, though. What's about, what about this one? Honor the Fallen. I think I'll go for Honor the Fallen. It's The cooldown is just a little bit too much on the other one. 185 seconds is a big cooldown. All right. Onwards and upwards we go. Let's roll, baby. Do I have to choose between these two? Or do I get them both? Oh, shit. I'm already full rage. Oh, shit. Something this costs lost. 40 health. Okay. Something's gained here. See, I'm not going to do that right now because of the one that I have. What about this one? I can... Yeah, that's perfect because the rage thing is over there. That's actually perfect. Stats glyph. Bang, bang. Let's go. Blessing of honor or blessing of defense. Uh, I'll go for blessing of honor. Brings our health up a little bit as well. And then that brings us nearly right back up. That's so handy. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Four more encounters to survive, remember. Back in your time. I hope you'll forgive me for overhearing. But before you first found your way to me, you were grappling with the symbolism of your former seat of power. May I offer a perspective? You may. Before I became God of War, I felt a hesitant. I feared that taking the throne would only validate Odin's power hierarchy, which even then I didn't trust. But I decided I could wield a better influence on the inside than on the outside. There are many ways to lead, and not all of them involve ruling. The throne and the office are only what you bring to them. Fair enough. Fair enough. It's a good perspective. <laughs> How is he blocking those? There's just no way. Like, I'm hitting him in the legs with those. Nice. Right. That's three more encounters, right? I think. Yeah, encounters to clear three. Okay, cool. Good fight. Stand and fight, cowards. Right. Dear, earlier you spoke to me as though I seek to lead. As if I were someone to be followed. Your self-criticisms, valid and otherwise, seem well reflected here in Valhalla. It's no accident that your mind manifested that throne. It's more than a symbol. It's a challenge to revisit your assumptions. Mimir is right. You have the power, and I think the wisdom to redefine what it means to you. To assert that power and prove to yourself that the chair doesn't change you, it doesn't make you a new person. Not if you know who you are and why you serve. 
Okay. I respect that. Fuck it, let's try it. Let's try this one first. I believe your target's on the battlefield there. Is he now? Is that my target? Yeah, it is. Holy shit, okay. You like them apples, bitch? Damn, he's up in the air. I can't get him. All right, let's get rid of that for a second. He did say behind me, Mimir. I apologize for not listening sooner. Got him! Noise, just kill him before he got me. That's such a good attack, actually. Look at that. Oh, oh his head just came clean off there. Lovely. His head just came clean off. And we got a nice runic attack as well. Here we go. Tuvalala. Good. The route to the higher area ought to be open now. It ought to be, sir. It ought to be. All right, let's go touch the ascending sands here. Yes, sir. Do I want to go for health refill or... Thor? No, it's Modi. Okay. Bloody Modi. Good to have you back, sir. Ah, it's actually fun as hell. No, no. Ah. Come on, Modi, you're done, son. This this one lasts so long as well. It's just crazy how long it lasts, dude. Like I, this has lasted the whole fight, man. Like I've just been able to kill him the whole time with it. Oh, nice dodge, nice dodge. Boosh. He's just gone. <laughs> what can a son of Thor out of your memory of all things? Is that all of the encounters done now, or is there one more still? That I have to do before my health comes back to normal. Visit all nine rel uh, nine uh, visit all nine realms in Valhalla. There we go. And lest we forget Kratos, lest we neglect to place your deed in full and proper context, I saved your life. Me! And you literally tore off my head for my troubles. Imagine if all your new friends knew how you used to treat your old friends. Of course, you're not the same man, right? Now, you only get your friends killed through lack of foresight. Far easier to blame others that way, am I right? I know you are a projection of the mind. But for what it is worth, the death I committed was unjust. Oh, how touching. Yeah, not actually worth the spittle it took to mumble that out. Do not do that again. Nobody wants to hear that from you. Nope, we got this again. Pick up the object of judgment this time. A little something to remember me by. I truly hope it brings you unrelenting torment. Chills the eyes are blue again. That, doesn't it? Feels like judgment. He said that last time. Continue to Greece. Memory completed. Helios' shield. It's not going to let me touch him, obviously. Mm-hmm. Well, this should be fun. Oh, 
The siren again. Come on, siren, let's have it. Kill a monster, I see. Come on, you silly little bitch. Gotcha. Gotcha badly. Good lord almighty. There's more? Ow. Cool. I'm untethered. I'm untethered, okay? Let's all just relax. Okay. Come on, you. The more? Good night. Some more of these rats. Gotcha. We got a, the Brahma Bull here. Who's charging at us? I see that. Thank you, Einstein. Look at that. Ow, not cool, bro. Gotcha! Rip his jaw. There we go. A little health burst after that, too, because we killed him with the spear. You win this round, awesome. Kratos. Burden has been lifted. Using runic attacks of three different weapons in quick succession grants a buff of increased stagger resist and creates a storm of bifrost. Or defense and cooldown up by three. I'll do that one. Ooh, there's five this time. Okay. Interesting. Fleeting Echoes multiplier. Each Valhalla's chosen slain greatly increase the amount of Fleeting Echoes gained. Hm. Come on now, boy. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go immediately, son. Ah! Hey, Loghead. Focus on the important one. I can down. I am. That's a pretty easy one to kill. Actually. Not that yet, but... From behind, incoming! Oh, sick. Gotcha, buddy. Gotcha. Bitch. New arena available. The Aegon boat can be found in the East Wing. Huh. Okay. Cool. So You're that's what that is. It's just a little arena. An arcane refresh or a risen might. Launching an enemy has a high luck chance to increase Kratos' strength. R didn't realize my mic was so far away. Apologies there. Uh, and stagger resistance for a duration. Yeah, let's do the arcane refresh. I think I already had that before. So I'll do it again. Right, that gives us a small bit of time back. How do I get up there, by the way? Because I can't get up there from here. The red one? Does the red one mean it's the hardest one? That's what it seems like, based on what I'm saying. Oh, this. I want to say. Troglodyte? Troglodyte is a good word. I like that word. Do you need for that, Bob? Don't let him heal. I don't know if he's healing, but it seems like that's what he was about to do. Come here, you little bitch. Come here, you siren. Who are you? Look how long this lasts. It's so good how long this is. Quite incredible, honestly. Come on, boy. How do I get rid of this? I don't know if I can, to be honest. Come on, boys. Behind you, idiot. I am aware he's behind me, but... I'm trying to take care of the other one first. All right. Yeah, we didn't really have enough time. Blessing of Courage or Winter's Bite. Light runic attack. Form a massive ice around the Leviathan Axe and run up to strike a target with incredible force. Let's do that. Because we don't have a light runic attack for it right now. Okay. We shall take this. I'm pretty low on health, eh? 
A splice dive and actually low on health. Struck him with my shield. Just give me a second, man. This guy doesn't give me a second to breathe, does he? Oh, shit. Okay. What the fuck's going on? Oh, oh shit, man. I wasn't ready for that. You give me a Valhalla's Chosen and then you... You give me this bitch to fight. Oh! Oh, shit. I have a resurrection storm. Holy shit. Okay. Why is this person so fucking hard to fight, dude? Wrong weapon, man. I know. I'm aware here. Jesus Christ. Got him. Okay. Jesus Christ, man. You opened a way forward with your blood-soaked savage ways. Yes, I have. Thank you very much. Momentous rune or defense and luck. Increase the damage of runic attacks. With... I'm going to go for defense and luck. Because we need some extra defense right now, clearly. I have to use my bloody resurrection stone, unfortunately. Um, I think that's my only one, so... Jesus Christ, man. Like, that was... That seemed absurdly difficult compared to what we've had to deal with in the past, but... That's alright. I think we're back out already. I need to... I need to heal up if I can. Alright, let's ascend. Let us ascend once more, my friends. Tear, oh, I'm back. Oh, brother, I'm back. Ah, the end of another gauntlet. Indeed. I have another cherished weapon from my travels to show you. Ready to see? Oh, shit. Those are badass. All right, let's do it, Tear. I wasn't fucking able to. Let our battle clear your mind. No, I pressed the wrong button. I'm dead. I'm panicking. I'm panicking. I'm panicking. No, I'm not ready to win. I'm ready to lose. They like them apples. Here. Jesus, how? I didn't get to use this for long. Fuck, oh, man. This guy, he's so quick with these. Disappeared as I was doing it. That scumbag material here. How did it feel to plunge your homeland into darkness? Not great. I did not intend the land to suffer, but I was indifferent, consumed only by rage and retribution. That is not what I asked. How did it feel in that moment, your soul given over to darkness, bringing a darkness over everything you could see? It felt true. Darkness, huh? Your curse! Fucking hell, dear. There's light over there, brother! Hold for it. Get back in the light, brother! Defend yourself! That's actually a hard one to block, the timing. Be ready! I see you, Kratos. One of the top. Fuck off! Are you joking, Tyr? Jesus, I was trying to just go away and I couldn't. Come on, we got him. You dickhead, no way. No way he's gonna do that. Brother, find the light! Fucking in the light, but how is he not dead? Yes! Come on, here, you're done. Oh my god. Took longer than it should have. We got him dead to rights. He yields. I yield. I yield. Good. Good then. Alright, dear. 
Good fight, though. I don't think you were indifferent, Kratos. I think you were hurt. Deeply hurt. And you handled it unskillfully. Wait, is that you restoring the sun? You took Helios' chariot and put the sun back in the sky, but sacrificed yourself in the process. Yes, I fell to my death and was saved by Helios. But this memory happened before I killed him. My evils were yet to come. What is the point? That your legacy has always been a complicated one. That goodness is not a destination we arrive at, but a practice. Misfortune may drive anyone to darkness. We resist it only through wisdom and vigilance. You are not so unskillful now as you were then. Better voices in your head, you might call it. I think that's enough for now. You have much to contemplate. Yes. Back to the beach, then. You should be proud of your progress, Kratos. See you soon. So not done yet. We're not ready yet. Damn it, man. I thought that was going to be the one we were ready for. Huh. All right. We're getting there, though. We are getting there. Axe Blade Sphere number four unlocked. We are back. It seems like you're making progress, whatever you're doing in there. Perhaps. Listen, I... No, I made you feel like we expected more of you than you could give. And I just want you to know, I'm not asking you to change how you are or who you are. We had to break the old world to build a new one. Picking up the pieces and putting them together stronger, it's a rare opportunity. You made a difference here. In some circles, a symbol of change. On many days, just knowing that you're a part of the Council is enough. And other days? You've earned a voice. How you use it is up to you. Okay, the work part two, vigilance complete. Freya's words of wisdom will help us, no See, doubt. Inside, we encountered a son of Thor. It wouldn't really be him in there, I can assure you. You have a memory of a past fight, and I'm sure Valhalla takes advantage. But why okay. him? I don't think that's for me to say. Well, something for us to ponder in between melees. <laughs> to adapt right. is to lean into the alchemy of turning adversity into advantage. Okay. First, oh, fucking hell, that looks cool as hell, doesn't it? I kind of like the black bear one we're rocking right now, but that does look badass. I think it just suits Kratos a little more, the black bear one. I love it. Look how sick that axe looks on our back right now, man. Every battle is an opportunity, right, General? Yes, Schooner. Bargain away, brother. Valhalla expects it. Okay. Valgrind. The work part three. Benevolence. How many of these works is there, bro? Come on. I'm hoping this is the last one. Three is the magic number, you know, so it kind of makes sense to me that it would be. You have to go through three times and get to tier and beat tier three times. And then we finally learn what we need to learn. See you, Frost Resolve, Blade Rush, drastically increases the power of the Russian Chaos and Chaos Slam. Boom, boom, boom. Drastically increases the power of the Gale Force skills. I'll do increases defense and stagger resistance on that one. Okay. Onwards we march. Come on then, losers. Who wants it? I love the way it like continuously hits them there. That's so bad. <laughs> that was sick. Oh, so much fun, man. Alright, what are we gonna get first? Cause you are out of my league. I like how there's a new theme to every time you're going up another run. A substitute daughter. A box full of evils. This one feels important. This is your blacksmith's story, isn't it? His girl was the key, and he died protecting her? Protecting her from me. I opened that box seeking a means to kill Ares. 
in what I released. Pretty much turned all the gods crazy. Uh, thanks again for that. Quiet, Ed. Unfortunate. The time I spend in my own Valhalla means you get more time with him. Mm -hmm. Had enough of him, to be honest. All right, we got this one here. How well did you know the blacksmith's dog? Pandora. She reminded me of my old daughter, who I lost long ago. I'm sorry, Kratos. Even at your most vengeful, you must not have wanted to see harm come to her. Pandora was innocent. The way she saw things, she could reach me when few could. She deserved better than to be a pawn, sacrificed in the game of gods. Your regret is palpable, but thank you for letting yourself remember. That is important. Really annoying. Locks and parries have a moderate luck chance to empower Kratos' next attack to strike with a damaging explosion. Oh, it's fucking worth it, though. Isn't it? Four encounters, we can deal with it. So let's just try not to, uh, like, oh, that's so annoying. But, uh, we gotta deal with it. Even a short we gotta deal with advantage it. could pay off. There's an arena one downstairs, but I'm gonna go for this one. Just so we can get a few more things. Got a few more things, man. Oh, that was sick as he was coming at me. Nice dodge. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool to the left. Hate those little bastards up there. I had to dodge. I see that, son. Right, you need to stop dodge rolling as well. Let's try parry more. What's up, bitch? Alright, all dead. And dead to you as well, pal. All right, Fleeting Echoes 48. Uh, both the same cooldown. I'll go for this one, Valdi's Anvil. Okay. Probably my final session in God of War Valhalla. Apologies, I am sick. You'll be able to hear it in my voice. Uh, but uh, I want to get this game done because it's been a hot minute. I've been distracted by other stuff continuously now. But I want to get this done. I think we can go up the Rising Sands right now. Um, maybe we can't, actually. I thought we could. But we have this door here. We can go through the arena. Um, let's see if there's another one. Is this the choice door or is this just that's the only door? I'm not sure. I think that might be. Oh, no. There's another one here. Oh my god, guys. I have a bad cough. Uh, I'm feeling okay, generally. But bad cough. Couple days to Christmas. Merry Christmas. This video will probably be out sometime just after Christmas, Christmas I would imagine. Depending on how long it takes good old Santa Kagi to edit it. <clears throat> Come on, then, you little loser. How, how long am I going to be frozen here? I'm moving so slow. I can't, there's no way I could possibly be moving this slow. Jesus Christ. All right, we're picking up the pace now. Ow, you bastard. All right, need to get back into the swing of things as well. I was actually playing Final Fantasy 16 quite a lot. That's a re one of the reasons why I was distracted. I was trying to finish Final Fantasy 16 for a video at the end of the year um, where I'm talking about all the games I beat. But I guess I want to probably put this in there as well. Even though it's not a full game, I think this still deserves like a... Fucking hell, this bitch is annoying. All right, I'm just going to fucking go Valhalla mode. Come here, you little silly... Fucking God, you're annoying. You're an annoying little scumbag, all right? And you too. You're going down too, but I want to get the other one first. Ah! Come here. Stupid little idiot. God, that was bad by me. I don't know how I didn't lose more health there, but... That's all right. That was stupid out of me, but we're good. Still got it. Barely. Barely. Mimir, all right? 
Grants a blessing of cooldown when interrupting double blue ring attacks. Doesn't happen that often. Holding L1 for several seconds will trigger a high stun explosion on the next successful block or double. Ooh, fortification sounds pretty good. That'll kind of um, maybe make us use the block a little bit more as well. Back in Midgard, baby. To speak about she was eager to receive you mere days ago. What has changed? Oh, don't pretend to be interested in my romantic life, brother. I am interested, and you are evading the question. What happened? Well, after you dropped me off at the longhouse the other night, Seagram made a cow berry and hazelnut pudding. Of course, I don't eat anymore, so slightly awkward, but a lovely thought. And? Pretty much it, really. Hmm. There is more to this. Come on, tell me. All right, who wants it? Ooh, okay. Ooh, I love that. Get dodged on, son. Ah. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Thank you. All right. You too, pal? Sorry, but you're coming to me. I love that attack, dude. That's so sick. All right. That's all of them, I think. What is this? Oh, I can pick up the tree and throw it if I wanted to. Oh, you're still alive up there. Hey. Hey, buddy. <laughs> that was beautiful. <laughs> Apologies. Encounters to clear one. Okay. For frost roll. I don't remember that. Blessing of luck. Just brings our luck up. Let's go for that because we, we do want to use our block a little bit more now. I have 330 coins as well. I need to be using these a little bit more. All right, let's go through. Let's go through, baby. I see the one you need to get there. Valhalla's chosen. Oh, I need to actually get up there. I see. Shit. I need to stop the doing that. Nice. That's beautiful. Oh, how do I not dodge that? Nice. Knocked him off the edge, dude. That was sick. Wait, was that not the chosen? No, it was. Okay, let's go. Boom! Nasty. All right, beautiful stuff going on here. This is a, this is a nice little scrap. I'll tell you that much. Unstoppable aura. Come here, you bitch. Nice. I can't even get close enough to fucking hit this stupid one. All right, let's use the spear. Ow! <laughs> This is getting fucking annoying now. I can't get close enough. Enjoy that tree, bitch. How oh, you like them apples? Come on now. Oh my god, Kratos. Come on, how you like them? Ah! Yes! That's the one you needed. Alright. I think Valhalla's button is satisfied. I'd bloody well hope so, son. But I need more health as well if I can. I need a health boost somewhere along the way. Oh, here it is. I, I was wondering where the hell the chest was. It was right in front of my eyes the whole time. I'm a little bit sloppy through the first fights here. It's been probably about a week since I've played yeah, now, which is now. crazy. Shall we? we shall, but first I need a little bit of a health boost, all right? C'est la vie. We haven't got a very good uh, good run this time, I feel like. I've been kind of unlucky with the way we've, uh, way we've progressed this time around. But... Let's do it. Who are we fighting this time then, Kratos? Another one of Thor's sons? Magni. Shit. Oh, shit, man. Fuck. Okay. Oh, no. How the fuck am I meant to stop that? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Nice. Come on. Use that shit. Let's go. This is close. Oh. 
Yes, we got him. Holy shit, we got him. That was close as hell. Look at my health right now. <laughs> oh my god, dude. That was the closest I've been to death without dying. Magni's been taken care of. That was awfully close. Rage restore? I want the bloody health restore, not a rage restore. Come on. Oh, for God's sake. That's not what I need right now. Okay. All good. I'm hoping we get some health somewhere along the way. Tame the beast? Yeah, I'll do tame the beast. We need some runic attacks. I don't think we're going to be able to get much further, though, with the health we have right now. Good lord almighty. That's awful. Guess you're not done with me yet, Kratos. Oh, bloody Helios. Okay. Tell me there's health. Oh, there's one of these things. Tell me it's not sold out still. Over that little extra nudge you gave them. Opening the box was Athena's plan. I did not know the consequences. You would claim ignorance of the consequences of trusting Athena? Is that your idea of a joke, Kratos? Because I admit it's hilarious. <laughs> but let's be real, Kratos. Whether you should have suspected the consequences or not, you certainly can't claim that you would have cared about them. You have the power to kill Ares. And because you wanted it, everything is justified. That's your moral code at the end of the day, isn't it? It was. That, you once again holding an office of solemn metaphysical responsibility. A trusted figure. A worshipped figure. The absolute gall of you to let yourself consider such a thing. I guess irony can have you when it earns you. <clears throat> Fair enough, honestly. Fair enough. Okay, pick up the object of judgment. Oh, how precious. I don't think you can be trusted to keep that safe at all. Pretty sure he agrees with me. Helios is such a little dickhead. <laughs> Alright. Let's keep it going, though. We got this. No Kratos, no Scry. Reclaim Pandora's statue. And continue to Greece. Right. I should be able to get myself some health here, I'm imagining. Alright, let's see. I need it really badly. Yes. Oh, thank God. I need it, really. I need to do it. Still doesn't get us back up to full, but that's alright. And it's only three encounters, although this first encounter is, this first encounter is probably going to be a tough one. We'll, we'll give it our best shot. Alright, come on. Come on then, you little goose. You can hit him? Come on. Oh, shit. I'm untethering myself. Jesus Christ. You silly little bitch, yeah? Rah! Oh my god, bear hug. And a beheading. Lovely. Yeah, my bad. I thought it was the same one, man. Relax. Rah! Nice. Alright, that should be them done and dusted, right? Oh, no. Certainly not. Oh, yeah, I can't block, huh? Incoming well, I could, charge. but... Ow, man. Come on. Not cool. Fuck. Oh. Oh, I'd still hit her. Yeah. Have these spears, milady. Ow, oh, fuck. That was good, actually. Back here. He's blocking is fucking poisoning me, I guess. Oh, I'm dead. This is the only way I can survive here. Are you serious, Kratos? How am I so bad today, guys? Like, is the sickness wearing on my mind, too? I'm not I'm not sure. Alright, dead, dead and dusted. We got back a little bit of our health, at least, but that's not very good. Dragon's Fury. Block and parries grant a buff of increasing strength and defense with each stack. Resets when damage is taken. Oh. After returning from rage, get a brief buff to strength, defense, runic, and stagger resistance. Uh, yeah, that could be handy. I think that one. <laughs> uh, we'll go with that. All right. We need, to we need to kill six. Jesus Christ. All right. 
Shimmering Rifts contain prominent rewards. Okay. Wow, this one it contains a prominent reward. So let's try this one first. Does that make them harder as well, though, I wonder? Maybe. Maybe. Don't worry, Kratos. None of these foes are real. They Thank you for that. Okay. Isn't that funny? <laughs> Thought you'd want to know. This guy's an asshole. <laughs> Incoming crossfire up above. Hail one flows. Why must they float? How you like them apples, boy? Nice dodge. That was beautiful. We took care of this guy quick. All right, now I'm, I'm getting into my rhythm again. All right, I'm getting into my rhythm again. We can all calm down. Yeah, I'm blind. I know I am. I hate these ones. I hate these little quick... Well, we got them quickly this time, though. I told you. My rhythm's back. My rhythm's back, baby. We're doing this quickly. Whisper of the world. I'll go with that. All day. I don't even care what the ability is. I need runic attacks right now. I only have bloody two or something. We have 2,000 fleeting echoes right now. That's a lot, man. Ow. I'm dead. Nice! That was beautiful, though. How's he not dead yet, man? Like, that guy should have been dead so long ago. Fuck's sake. Man. I'm just choking today. Enemy, dif enemy difficulty increased. Beautiful. New arena available. The Desert of Lost Souls can be found in the West Wing. You know, I think I'm okay right now. Uh, using runic attacks of three different... No, I don't want that. I want strength. All day. Ooh, we got a red one here. Those are usually the toughest ones, but... God damn it, we got it. Oh no, there's health over there! No, shit! I could've got the health first, and it's one of these fuckers as well. Oh, this is bad. I have a feeling we might be in trouble here. Nice. Are you fucking dumb, Kratos? Like, seriously? Oh, that was clutch. What? How did that happen? That's fucking bullshit, man. Incoming charge. Thank you. I need to get this fucker off me, man. You're joking. What just happened? Behind. Incoming. I'm dead. Oh my god, I'm dead. Please don't do this. Even hit him. That didn't even hit him. Fuck, man. Oh my god, I have a resurrection stone. Holy shit. Okay, holy shit, I do. That's goaded right now. That is so clutch. Holy shit. I'm gonna fucking. Thank you. <laughs> Just said I need to be patient, and then he said, "Great job, not hurrying." As I'm rushing. <laughs> That's pretty funny, actually. And the difficulty just got fucking more difficult, too. I am so fucked, man. It's insane. Are you fucking joking me? Fuck, man. God almighty. Oh, my God. That's like my first death in a long time, too. I have to start from the fucking beginning. Yeah. I blame Helios, too. Fuck's sake almighty. I'm a dickhead for that. I'm just so bad today, guys. I don't even know what to say. I'm terrible. Yeah, shut up. What is this? I haven't seen this before. Oh, it's a key. Is that hey. A key. And look, it's the. Did it unlock something important? Only a memory. Seems Valhalla thinks you have a story to tell. That's dope. All right. Leo. Tell me, Back in Midgard. What happened between you and Sigrun on the lake? Well, she was rowing past where you found her family treasury. Where we learned she cursed her brother over forbidden love. That's right. And as we rowed by, I remember feeling grateful that the place was now deep underwater where she couldn't see it. And at that moment, she turned to me and she said, I think, Mimir, I might be smitten with you. I think maybe I want to kiss you. Mm. Indeed, brother. I mean, there's always been more to us than there's been the opportunity to explore. So much unspoken beneath the surface. But hard to name it so boldly. Uh, it took me a bit off guard. 
And what did you say? Stop telling the story in such small increments. I want to know what the hell you said next, pal. Tell me, damn it. Ah, the story. Keep talking. Keep talking, Mimir. Tell me what happened on that damn lake. Back in Jotunheim. I am still waiting for the part where you spoke. Yeah, come on, in my man. defense, I only told her the truth as it struck me in the moment. I told her my feelings for her were deep as Rand Paul and had been for as long as I'd known her. But just then a kind of revelation came over me. I suddenly told Clarity that it was vanity to imagine that I, as I am, could be enough for her as she is. So I heard myself tell her that I didn't think I could give her what she needed. Now, I am mad at you. File on, brother. I deserve it. <laughs> oh, you idiot, Mimir. All right, this is a much better run than last time. No, wait, I don't have a lot of abilities yet, but I think uh, overall I'm pretty happy with how we... Uh... Oh, this guy's a fucking beast. How you like them apples, big boy? The little werewolf freak you. Yeah? Ow, bro, I was in the middle of an attack. That's not cool. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, there's two of them. Dodging my spears, this little son of a bitch. Ow, bro. I'm trying to fucking pick up a tree and you're just... That's just not cool, man. How you like them apples, you little bitch? Ah, uppercut city. Rip his jaw off, Kratos. Come on now. Good Lord almighty. Don't you howl at me, boy. Don't you howl at me, boy. Touch the ascending sands, Kratos. Let's do this thing, baby. Oh, shit. Olaf Nautzen. How do you like this, out, Olaf? Oh, sorry, Olaf. I didn't mean to do you that badly, son. Didn't work? No. Enjoy that, Olaf Natsen. That was beautiful, actually. Gorgeous. Ah, gotcha. No! Sometimes I keep pressing. Oh, why do I keep doing that? I keep pressing L3 and R3 together by accident. <laughs> I didn't take that much off us anyway. We're all good. Okay. Good stuff. Return to tier. Oh, shit. I probably could have actually gone and used my fleeting echoes on some of those chests there, but I didn't. Oh, I'm back again. Still not used to that. Well done, Kratos. Is this the last time we have to beat you, tier? I have one last weapon to show you. Yes. I think you'll enjoy it, if that's the word. Okay. Oh, no way. I dodged too early. I hate the way, like, your abilities aren't reset before this fight, <laughs> you know? Really? That still hit me? Like, what the fuck do you want me to do, bro? What the fuck? There's two of you? This is much harder than has happened before, man. What? Alright, this is not good. Those health things are giving me fuck all. How do, you, how do you... You just got blocked that one, I guess. I'm dead, dude. I don't have a resurrection stone or anything either. Fuck, man. I'm dead. 
Thank you. Fuck, man. Wait, I do have one? Oh, shit, I do, but I'm still fucked. There's no way I'm, I'm doing this now, I don't think, unfortunately. Like, this guy, this one's hard, man. Arms up. Thank you. Fuck. Lads, that one's impossible to know, like... I know. Also, why is my block so shit? Like, half the time my block isn't even working. No, I'm not having fun at all. The box we saw you open in the scrying pool. Oh Jesus. What was inside exactly? You're joking. Vanity. Hatred. Amplifying what the gods already possess. What else? I'm fucked. How am I supposed to do this, man? Thank you. Oh, I'm fucked. <laughs> Fucking hell, this is difficult now. Ah, that's a really hard fight. It's by far the hardest fight so far, man. Well, perhaps we'll get Father making different choices. We must strike a balance between discipline and creativity. And the wheel of progress turns. Kratos versus Valhalla. No shame in me. I will do Valor this time. Yeah, I didn't like that one that we just had there, actually. I didn't like that one at all. How fair are you and your sisters? With just the three of us to attend to the Fallen now, we're short-handed. But we've begun recruiting new shield maidens. Well, I happen to know of one lass who'd jump at the chance to join your ranks. You mean Throot, Sif and Thor's daughter? <laughs> Believe me. I know. She sought us out before the call even left our lips. She fights well and can be trusted. A recommendation from you, General. With that, how could we ignore her? Not that she'd let us. <laughs> yeah, it's a good call. Throot is a good one. She's a good soul. The key again. More to the story? Yes. The keys of the That's captain. Fine. Two out of three. So, you told Sigrun you could not give her what she needed. Tell me more. You spoke out of cowardice. Aye, obviously. But as prospects for terror go, can you imagine knowing all along you're not enough for someone, and then living out their slow realization of that truth? I admit it chilled me to the bone. You presume to know how she will feel in the future. Why discredit her wishes and yours in the present? I just can't pretend not to know better. She's romanticized the idea of it. Certainly I've done the same. Is that anything to build a future on? I mean, look at me, brother. Be practical. If anyone else disparaged you as you disparaged yourself, I would wish to strike them with an axe. <laughs> Yeah, I understand where he's coming from, you know. He is just ahead, but... <clears throat> you know, if Sigrun, Sigrun knows what she's getting into. It's not like she doesn't have a clue what, what's going on or anything. She knows, man. Now, back to Sigrun and your low opinion of yourself. Yeah, tell us. What's Look, up, bitch? I don't apologize for wanting her to have someone who can be everything to her. She deserves the best. Then why should she not deserve the smartest man alive? Sometimes I think you've come too far, brother. We <laughs> better step. No, no, Kratos. I appreciate your point. And to be fair, if I was so right, then why am I so angry at myself? Yeah, there you go. <clears throat> Kratos, about this boat, Captain. If you needed his key to save others, why does it seem to bother you? Your actions in this case seem justified. 
Somehow survived, dangling over a fall that would surely kill him. I saw the terror in his eyes as he fought to hold on. And in relief, I would save him. Instead, I took the key and dropped him to his death. And Messed up. All for nothing. If we're pushing ahead, we better let you focus. <laughs> he's, he's like, I don't want to talk about that anymore. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> All right, is this another one of those things? Precision spear throws. Oh, cool. Land 12 precision spear throws on enemies. Okay, we could do that. Spirit seal and drop near crest. Well, yeah, I, I think I can do that. I don't know. Precision throws, are they that hard? I'm not sure. And does it tell me exactly like how many, how much time I have to do it or is it just unlimited? I think it might be unlimited, you know, so we'll take that. I have a completely different run this time so far. I haven't really been talking through it too much, so I'll probably edit through it a little bit, but because I wanted to just get back to the same point I was at, but yeah, it's completely different, honestly. It's pretty fun so far. Oh my god, is it ever. Right, let's try this out, though. Oh, beautiful. Great job not hurting. You do let your fight he got that done pretty much right before. Nice. This is beautiful. <clears throat> this is how it's done, baby. Good night, Irene. Good Lord Almighty. Good talk. That was sensational. All right. Good night. All right, we need to get this last one done ASAP. When he's below 50% health. Oh, fuck yeah, I'll do that. This one's good, but desperate measures. Perfect perk lift. That's horrendously good. 50% is a lot still, you know, like. But, oh, should I do this? I think I might, you know. Fuck it, I'm going to do it. Just because we have that. This is one of those extra ones. This might prove to be a bad idea, but fuck it. Let's go. Enjoy the cyclones, baby. Behind you, idiot. That was beautiful. Sensational, even. The combos we're hitting now is, are just nasty. Good stuff. That was beautiful. Uh, Breath of Tamor, heavy runic attack. I don't think I have a heavy one, do I? No, I don't. So that could be a lifesaver. I'm going to go for that. Uh, Kratos' melee damage increases based on his rage, and incoming damage that would be lethal is absorbed by available rage. Holy shit. Drastically increases Kratos', Kratos melee damage when he is above 75% health. Holy shit, okay. So we have one that's above and then one that's below 50. So honestly, if we're above 75% or below 50, we're doing drastically increased damage. So this run is good so far, guys. I think we need to go for it. It took us about a half an hour to get back here, man. Come on. Let's go. Let's go, Tyr. I know your abilities now. I'm ready for you, baby. All right, we gotta be blocking more. But the only thing is the block isn't that good. Like... Like, my, when I start blocking, it doesn't take long before he's back in business, you know what I'm saying? Yo, that's not the same weapon he had before, though. What the fuck? I pressed the wrong button. You dipshit idiot. It's not a good start. That's a different weapon, though. Oh, no, it's not. Fuck yeah, that's the one that gets me every time, man. I love this attack, though. I love this one. Fucking hell, I'm getting... Oh, 
I can't even do anything while I'm in this. Fucking hell. How'd that still hit me? Oh, here come the ads. This is when it gets fucking ridiculous, though. You told me fear, deceit, hatred. Yes, magnifying what was already in the gods. You know very well something else. How does that? Yes. Come on. Where'd he go? Where'd you go, you pussy? Come on, tear. What's up now, bitch? You bastard, tear. You dodged that one, fucker. How does that still fucking hit me? Like, how long is that attack gonna last, man? How does that? All right, we just need to calm down now. He's done. We got him. Come on, baby. You're done, Tear. God, that was difficult, but we did it finally. Tell me I can go through now, Tear. He yields. He yields. I yield. Hard fought. Let's see Tell me I'm ready. Out. When the evils of the box were purged, what remained was hope, which you chose to release back to the world. Yes. After everything, you came back full circle to sacrificing yourself. My death would have been just, but it was not to be. Yes, you lived, and hope still lived inside you from that day to this one. One might say you brought hope back to these realms after a long slumber. Box or no box, Kratos. Hope and fear and love and hate exist in every one of us. The question is, which will you choose to let guide your actions? Each choice we make shapes our world. Mm -hmm. I see the truth of it. And? I believe I am ready to walk through that door. Excellent. It's about damn time. Is there anything left in here, Tear? I'll see you later, man. It's been real. I hope it actually works now. Come on. Push through, Kratos. Let's go. He had that hint of doubt there for one second before opening the door. But I think he's ready. What can I say to you? Remember how it felt to take that throne. All that it meant. And all that it did not. A god of war. God of pain. Of suffering. Of destruction. And no one said I chase redemption. That I know I can never deserve. 
does that make me? God of fools. A god of... Everything. And everyone. You became... There is no forgiving you. You chose! myself in service. You are. But you are more than that. You have always been more than what others saw. You are more than that. Sick. Dude, that was so cool. The whole conversation, like <clears throat> seeing him talking to his old self, connecting the two games together. Two franchises together, I should say. It's the same franchise, but you know what I mean. Greek Kratos and Nordic Kratos. Just sitting on his head there, or what? Did you find what you needed? Hmm. Glad to hear it, brother. We're done here then, so. Uh, what now? No. I believe. I would like to sit here for a while. Mimir's little smile. Awesome. Just phenomenal DLC, honestly. I don't know what else I can really say other than that. Just an absolutely phenomenal DLC. For free, the fact that they did this and it's so unique and different to, to the actual main game, like, it, you, you don't really have to be clued up on the on god of war ragnarok like you don't have to have just played it or anything to really enjoy that dlc and that's the problem with a lot of these dlcs that i have is like i'm coming back to a story maybe a year later after i beat the game and honestly it's kind of hard to to just jump back into the dlc and jump back into a world but here it was so easy to do just simply because this was just a completely branched off separate thing it was it was it was so it was its own mode, but it also was so much more than what I anticipated this was going to be. I thought this was just going to be... Like, I didn't have any interest in playing this, actually. 
when I first heard like it's just a little roguelite game, like I was like, okay, like cool for people that want to enjoy it, but not really my thing. And then I just kept seeing really positive things said about it. And I'm so glad I decided to hold off on checking out cutscenes and everything and just played it for myself because it was a pretty magical experience and uh, I really did enjoy that immensely. And I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, full game video here. It was an absolute mammoth of a video, I know. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. One of the longest videos I've ever done on this channel, probably. Um, but fair play. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, it was an absolute blast. And hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm doubting there's any post-game stuff. Maybe there is a little conversation with Freya or something. He's such a badass, the way he's walking out and everything. God of hope. Sick. Dope as hell, man. Weapon appearance unlocked. Cool. Where's our uh, Where's our people out here? Should we go talk to them? The work well, part three: I, benevolence. I had no doubt you would see this through to the end. Thank you. Speak to Freya. Yeah, I kind of guessed we were gonna go talk to Freya. You have anything to say? Thank you. Let's go talk to Sigrun and Freya. Something must have happened in there. I take it this Freya, is a good I will join you. We just interrupted their conversation. <laughs> what people need. Good. I'm very pleased to hear that. And that you found what you needed here. I could not have done so without my friends. I am grateful. Valhalla is at your disposal, Kratos. If you have more you wish to work out, now or later, we will heed the call. Thank you. Start another attempt when ready? I think I'm good. Maybe I'll come back to it at some point, but we have mastered Valhalla. We can still go into the uh, Desert of Lost Souls, Aegon Boat, the Forum. We haven't done that yet, but for now, that's where we're going to end God of War. Valhalla, thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. Make sure to drop a like. It's the best way to let me know you enjoy the content and you want to see more videos like this going forward. Uh, can't wait to see where the God of War story goes next. See you next time. Thanks for uh, watching. Thanks for if you're still here. I mean, this is a long ass video, so if you're still here, respect. Thank you. GTA 4, more of it will be coming soon. Thanks for watching. Peace out.